Welcome to this week's ep- episode of the JOWP podcast. I'm with um, your usual host, Eduardo, and Joseph is here today. That's right. Yes, sir. Is there something you wanted to tell us, Eduardo? How many more of these hot chocolate things do you have? Bro. Uh, probably like 20. <laughs> have you used that box at all then? Barely. It's like 30 to start with. Oh. Uh, this stuff is good. You can what happened to you yesterday, Eduardo? Why'd you die? I have no idea. <laughs> I woke up. I had like my stomach was hurting already to begin with, and I'm like, okay, that's fine. It's a stomach hurt. I can deal with this. And my stomach problem, my stomach ache was gone, and it all went to my head, and I was just having a headache the whole day. And it was like getting like worse throughout the day. So you just went to sleep? Yeah, so I just went to sleep. Did you know rubbing a banana peel on your forehead helps headaches? No, I did not know that. I just went, what I did was I went into my kitchen, my pantry. I looked for any medicine that had to deal with like headaches and I just took them all. You OD'd. <laughs> so that's what happened to you yesterday. <laughs> you OD'd. Foaming at the mouth. <laughs> no one knew where you were. What's this medicine called heroin in the cabinet? I'll try it. <laughs> it says it helps headaches. I'll just. <clears throat> but there has been this one thing. My little sister has been asking me about like the podcast more. She's like, what's the name of it? And I'm like, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And then I finally broke last week. And she was like, Bro. what's the name of your podcast? And I was like, Jop. <laughs> She's like, how do you spell that? Sound it out. <laughs> True. She's going to say A. Exactly. <laughs> so whoever has Jop with an A. I don't think anybody You got knows. my little sister. <laughs> I think she... she'll know it's not you. Like, what if she finds it, though? What are you going to do? Nothing. Can't do anything about it. What if she, like, confronts you about everything you said and shows it to your mom? You know what she has confronted me about? Huh. Tinder being on my phone. So? I know, right? <laughs> we went to go eat out one day and she's like, I got a notification from Tinder. You know, it's like your profile's being hidden because you're not on it. Yeah. And she's like, oh, what's that? And I'm like, uh, it's Tinder. It's like, why do you have Tinder? And I'm like, what do you mean, why do I have Tinder? So I can get some pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to get some bitches, you know what I mean? And she's like, delete it. I'm like, why? <laughs> she's like, my my brother will not have Tinder. I'm like, like, in my mind, I'm like, you're young, right? You, you don't understand what your bro's going through. Does she think you're gay? <laughs> no. <laughs> you're so supposed to have like... Grindr. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, why aren't you on Grindr? I'm like, what do you mean, why aren't I Grindr? Isn't that, like, for you? I'm like, no. <laughs> She's like, no, I thought I thought that's, like, the way you swing. I'm like, no, <laughs> it's not <laughs> crazy enough. And then your mom's like, I thought so, too. And then dad's like, yeah, true. And the other sister's like true. I'll be like, and Happy's like rough, rough, true. And I'll be like, crazy <laughs> thought here. I'm straight. <laughs> no, you I only bring not. boys yeah, to the I house. Just go not. <laughs> I've I've brought females to the house before. But they're like, it's like the people who rejected you. True. So they thought <laughs> you like you would like. No, women is impossible. Women is impossible. You know what else happened though? My dad got TikTok. Yeah, I saw it. Didn't he fall? <laughs> a, Oh no, Devin's mom also got TikTok. Yeah. And Devin's mom followed, well, who is it, you? No. No. It was Tyler. Uh, no. Who was Ooh. it? I don't think she followed anyone. Someone said, yeah, someone said it yesterday. Uh, you were gone. But in Discord, yeah, yeah someone said Devin's mom followed me Maybe on Devin. TikTok. Maybe no, it wasn't Eddie? Devin. It wasn't Eddie. Eddie wasn't in Discord yesterday. Okay, so who? Had to be Tyler. <laughs> so it was either Tyler or, or Gabe. Well, it wasn't me. <laughs> well, and it, so and there was it down to Tyler. Well, that's why I thought it was you, but I guess I forgot you weren't there. I was OD'd. Yeah. I was busy, like, foaming at the mouth. I wonder if Devin's mom's going to find the podcast next. Ooh. It's over. It's, it's over. <laughs> she doesn't want to hear the stuff we say about Devin. <laughs> All the titles he gives himself. True. It's so funny because when I, I got the notifications, like someone followed you. So I went to go and click on it and it says Eduardo. And I was like, who is this? Is this another bot account? It just says Eduardo. And then a bunch of numbers. And I click on it and I went to the following and it's just me and my sisters following. I was like, oh, this is my dad. What if it's not? I confronted my dad about it. I was like, you have TikTok? And he goes, yeah. What are you gonna do if he starts making videos? Like, he like pops off. He's just like dancing. He's like doing he, like the, lot, like he does like boxing tutorials. He's on how to throw a punch. Left <laughs> He pulls like seven million views. Be like, Whoa. would you ask him to shout out the podcast? Uh, maybe. Maybe. Yeah, it'd be like, this is my son. He's in a podcast. Exactly. And, and then, like, oh and then I'll have a boxing match with my dad. And then they'll to come to the it. podcast and be like, oh, he's just like the, the other Eduardo. He must be cool. And they're like, oh, this guy's a loser. He's nothing like his dad. <laughs> he's nothing like his father. 
It just sounds like a uh, like a bad family reunion, right? <laughs> I don't know how I would feel if my dad like had all these numbers, and then he's like, "This is my son. He's he's just like me." And then come to the podcast. Why would he lie? I don't know. <laughs> he's a dad. And then come to the podcast, and I'm just like a villain. Nah. Quote unquote. My dad doesn't lie. What does your dad said about you? I don't know what he says about me after he hears these podcasts. <laughs> <laughs> my son's a menace. I don't talk about my son. <laughs> we don't talk about the podcast whenever I see him. <laughs> we talk about everything else. My, she neither, already knows. Neither does we, my we dad. The you both is know. <laughs> neither does my dad. My dad's just like, I, I tell him, I'm like, all right, I'm going to go and uh, record. And he goes, all right. <laughs> all right. Men will be men. And then he goes like, how's the podcast going? I'm like, great. You should let him listen. No. Why does my dad get a listen, but yours? Doesn't? I don't know how your dad found this. <laughs> I'm be honest with you. I'm not gonna tell my dad about the podcast. Your dad found the podcast. It's because he knew our group name. <laughs> it's easy. He enough. made the logo. <laughs> easy yeah. Enough. My dad knows nothing about the logo, the jokes. Oh great, we spoiled the secret. What secret? That my dad made the logo. Oh, don't worry about it. I don't worry about whatever. it. It was supposed to be a big reveal. Just... <laughs> no, don't cut it, Steven. But it was supposed to be like a grand reveal, and it was just like so anticlimactic. What's the, why was it going to be a grand reveal? Because like, everyone was going to be Q and A. How'd you get the joke logo? We, you know, we still, yeah. we still got how'd you, how'd you get the name? True. No one been, knows. We've that. been holding on to that for a while. True. <laughs> it's still in the test episode, I think. Oh, I know it's not. No, no. I don't know. Is it? I don't think so. I've heard your guys' theories in the anchor messages. Someone said jerking off white people. That's not it. <laughs> Did someone actually say that? <laughs> not on anchor. Someone said that on Instagram. That's the Instagram. That's not it. No, to... that's weird. Have we done anything with that Instagram? Uh, not in a while. There's like two posts on there. Yeah. Three. <laughs> three? There's three? The first post is the Jope logo. Yeah. And then there's uh, two pictures. Group pictures. <laughs> so what y'all do for Valentine's Day? <laughs> you were there, Eduardo. Okay. Did you do anything today? <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> well, they worked. I worked. Anything crazy at work? Were they like, oh my god, here's candy? Is this your sort of transition of you want to talk about what you did on Valentine's yes, Day? Yes, sir. <laughs> Go for it. So me, Devin, and Gabe went to Hooters for Valentine's Day, right? And you know they have this deal where it's like if you rip a picture of like, quote unquote, your ex, then you get free 10 wings oh yeah with a purchase true. of 10 wings so Devin was gonna be like oh my god this is my girlfriend he got a picture of this streamer <laughs> called emeru and it's on it's like a huge poster picture, yeah so he I looks was like, like a stalker <laughs> fan i was like what the heck is so this? funny because i don't have a printer and i guess Devin's printer wasn't working so we had to go to office depot so once we went there we had to like do the shite get it printed out and i don't know why but it got printed out on a long piece of paper <laughs> So it was like a mini poster. Yeah. So we pull up to Hooters and then he, this girl, right? She knew what she was doing, right? She kept like putting her tatas on her in. What are you talking about? You didn't oh, see that? the the server. Our, yeah, our server. Yeah. That was her name, which I forget. And I know her name, but I'm not gonna say her fake Hooters name. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> so that's right. She's like, "What did I just drop? What is this?" And she's like, like pushing her boobs out towards us. And I'm, I'm like, like, I'm like, bro, I was going to tip you regardless. You don't got to be all extra. I'm like, I'm not, I'm not an inst. Well, I'm not down bad. Yeah. Like Eduardo. I guess. <laughs> right. So she's, uh, she, I look at this. And I'm like, with a purchase of 10 wings, I got to purchase 10 for 10. This is stupid. I ended up doing it anyways. I mean, it's a good <laughs> deal. I was ordering t wings any anyways. It's, a good it's an deal. okay deal. It's a mm -hmm. pretty good deal. So they, they're like. I was like, I was expecting them to her just be like me ripping in front of her, then ten wings, easy, light work. But she's like, oh come, oh Devin backed out. I forgot to add that. That's Devin funny. was scared, so he, he was like, no, I don't want to rip this picture of my wife, like Twitch waifu Emiru. <laughs> he did come back to his senses though. Yeah, after like I, I made him go to the shredder. Yeah. So I'm like, I, you won't do it, I'll do it. So I go up to her and I'm like, this is his girlfriend, but I'll rip it for for wings. Can I do that? She goes. I guess. And I was like, let's go. So they take me to the shredder that has like, I don't know, it was like decorated for some reason. It was like in the corner of the Hooters. And she's like, oh my. And then she's like, everybody, we have someone ripping their ex. And I was like, great. <laughs> <laughs> A scene is being made. <laughs> and she's like, what happened? No, other girls were starting to ask. She's like, oh, one of the, the bartender was like, what happened? And, I, and, I'm, and in my mind, I'm like, I have two options. I could just lie, think of something right now. 
either way it's a lie because no one we don't know this girl in person i could yeah. think of something and be like she, she like she was a bitch she like pinched my balls while like going down on him but i at my mind i was That's like the reason you broke up with her <laughs> i was thinking of something dumb you know but i but in my mind i just was like i'll just be like, i'll just tell Devin. and he's like i don't know it's his girlfriend i'm just shredding it for wings and then she, they, they like all turn to Devin. she go and they go what's she doing and Devin's like like a deer in headlights <laughs> trying to think of something he goes she cheated on me <laughs> <laughs> And then they were like, oh, my God. What a bitch. And I was like, he should rip it, shouldn't he? And they're like, yeah. So then he goes over there. I start sitting at the table. They were having problems with that shredder, too. I don't know what was going on. And the shredder hole was, like, not big enough for the paper. For oh, <laughs> so I had to, like, fold the paper. <laughs> and then I'm like, what? Like, everyone's saying, just rip it. There's this guy behind us. He's like, women. They're, they're all the same. I don't know what Bro, he was what? saying. It was weird though. He was married. He was there with his wife. No, not that guy. The that. guy that was sitting by himself. Oh, the black dude. He was in front of us. Oh, I guess he was behind. Yeah, you, he was behind. But me. He was in front of me. Yeah. <laughs> he was like, women are all the same. Yeah. Like, <laughs> like he was like, you better not go back to her. I'm like, facts. You should not go back to her. But like, True. but like, calm down, guy. <laughs> He's like, women are all the same. You could tell he was like, never. Maybe he had one girlfriend, but he she definitely, did him dirty. Yeah, he's definitely a loner. Mm. He said that Hooters. He looks like a regular. <laughs> That's pretty sad. If you look like a regular Hooters, it's pretty, yeah. pretty sad. And then I come to find out, right? Devin comes back to the table. They got the shredder to fix, and so does our waiter. And I'm like, what was up with the uh, shredder? Well, why don't y'all just rip it? And she goes, when I set my mind to things, I'm determined. And I'm like, okay. It sounds like you're stubborn. Why'd you set your mind to suck in this dick? Try no, I'm not. No. I'm not like that. <laughs> <laughs> and then she, I just go like, "What was wrong with it?" And she's like, "Oh, apparently beforehand, at first, I thought like no one had used that shredder before us, and I was just assuming that the shredder was old." And she Probably said, is. "And she said that the shredder, the people kept trying to like uh, use more than one paper to shred, so that's why it was like stuck, I guess." Yeah, that makes sense. And Devin, oh. Devin folded to this server Devin always folds i remember this this girl she was like she, her name tag fell and she's like oh whoops so she like chest forward trying to adjust her name tag and i know what she's doing i know the game she's playing i'm like looking at the tv Devin was not Devin was like oh, i'll play your game what yeah. was Devin looking at what do you think Devin was looking at it's know. Devin. he was looking at what was being shown in front of him like a simple-minded man TV? he is no. <laughs> <laughs> he was looking at two things yeah mm -hmm. that were right in front of him yeah and then <laughs> De I think Devin's like, I'm gonna ask for a snap. And I'm like, go for it, buddy. Go for yeah. it. Why not? <laughs> I don't see what could go wrong. Go ask exactly. for a snap. But we all know Devin's not that guy. Yeah, Devin never asked He's for a snap. He's gonna fold. Devin. He always says things and then never lives up to it. Remember the, the, the infamous incident a couple weeks ago? He's like, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. And he never did. And he yeah. never did it. I know what you're referring to. Yeah. Yeah, Remember? I know. He didn't, no, he wasn't there. He wasn't there. It was just was me you and Eddie. Not? No, it was me, you, and Eddie. I swear. Oh, yeah. You're not in Discord as often anymore. <laughs> yeah. 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 That was just a known. He just De says things, but he just, he's all talk, no no bite. All bark, no bite. Yeah, Devin was like, Oof. Yeah, he basically it. said, I'm going to clap cheeks. And we were like, Henry. okay, prove, prove it. it. And he's like, okay, okay I bet. will. I will. And then never and did. Then he never did. Oh, he's, like, I'm, he's like, I'm going to be honest. I didn't get <clears throat> cheeks. Yeah, we're like, yeah, we know. Okay, was mm -hmm. that with, with the drive? Uh, No, it was a different one. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. I think it was the girl that he was like he turned gay on. <laughs> what? No, it wasn't that girl. No. It was before that. Remember the, a couple episodes ago? It wasn't even that long ago, Jose. <laughs> it's like two weeks ago. Dude, everything's been bleeding together. <laughs> it's not my fault. <laughs> okay, so remember, <clears throat> remember I said there was a topic I found on Twitter mm -hmm. that I was gonna bring up to you guys. Okay, Where yeah. Go? You asleep? Right, Basically, wonderful sleeping. sleeping up and wake up. Hoorah! Okay, I woke him up. All right. So the, basically, this dude said, it basically, it started with this guy on Twitter who said, which atrocity do you think is worse, the rumbling or the Holocaust? Oh, I think I saw that. <laughs> the guy goes, the rumbling is way cooler and more visually interesting, to be honest. Plus, True. the motives behind it were much easier to follow than the Holocaust. Aaron wanted to complete, wanted complete and total freedom for himself, whilst Hitler, for some reason, he censored the I in Hitler, wanted exactly what, exactly, rumbling solos. No, <laughs> what? It's so easy to understand. I think Hitler's had like a much simpler thing. He just wanted. Okay. Like, what did Hitler want? He was, <laughs> was kind of racist. He wanted the Aryan race. Uh, Aryan but race. 
the guy in the comments goes, uh, you know the you know the Drewski meme where he's like he's like backing up. Yeah. He puts his hands up. He goes. He's like, to be honest, Holocaust ain't even a top five genocide. Oh, true. I saw that. <laughs> yeah. And he listed five more yeah, he listed genocides. Five more. He's, and, he's, and this guy said, no shot, bro. Name five. He goes, all right. Rwandan genocide, European colonization of South America, Armenian genocide, airbender genocide, and Order 66. What? Uh, <laughs> oh, okay. Fiction. Then he had his fictional genocide. No, not okay. Well, three one. of those were real. Yeah. Well, yeah, the three of them were real. And then I was like, what is the airbender genocide? When have yeah, we ever honestly, had to deal with <laughs> And then you said Order 66, and I was like, oh, okay, those last two, it was like, one is Avatar, one is Star Wars. The fact that this man put two fictional ones at the top of his <laughs> list over real ones. Dude, exa- I, could, I couldn't even be like, I couldn't name five genocides. I couldn't, we, like, tried the, we tried that, remember, like, like yeah. weeks ago, like, almost half a year ago. Half well, a year really. ago? <laughs> it was like episode four or something. Naming genocides. It was only oh, the this or that You're right, episode. you're right, you're right, you're it right. The... Name five genocides, like, pfft. Yeah, we couldn't even name them. I don't know, Holocaust, number one. And Eduardo said, like, when he came 15 times in one night. True. What? Yeah. Oh, yeah, true. I told you that story. I remember. (laughs) Yeah. Where I was, like, a man of determination. Uh, What was that first one? The Rwanda genocide? Yeah. They had a whole movie about that. Hotel Rwanda. Uh, Hotel Transylvania. That's a good movie. This guy's- oh, before I forget, oh. when we left, Demon left his number on the receipt <laughs> for her. He says he did allegedly. You were there. Yeah, and I didn't see him do it, so I don't think he did uh, it. I think he's just saying that to look cool for you. Because you didn't. conveniently weren't there to see it. Right? So I think oh, he's saying it just to I look cool for you. went to the bathroom, and I came yeah. back and we were leaving. He's like, I left my number for him. I'm like, yeah. you're an idiot. <laughs> he didn't. He's just all talk. He didn't do anything. Mm-mm. He's like, he's like, I've never been to Hooters before. Maybe like they'll give you a chance. And we told them we were like, no shot, they won't. Yeah, who, uh, I've heard like notoriously from people who like like pick up girls a lot that Hooter girls are like really hard to pick up. Yep. Because they're pretty determined that like this is just a job and they don't mm. actually think anything about it. Yeah. Makes sense. Mm-hmm. This guy said top five people ever: my mom, <laughs> Joe Burrow, Morgan Freeman, Killua, and the nigga that made orange juice. Ah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what about your top five, Eduardo? Dude, I like my mom. <laughs> the guy that made toast. toast. Bread or toast? The guy who toast. thought to cook bread? No, the man who made toast. <laughs> the guy who was like, I'm cooking this. Yeah. <laughs> the man who made orange juice. Gotta agree with that, man. Well, it's kind of funny because to make bread, you have to like cook dough. So this guy was like, let's cook it again. Let's do let's it, again. it again. Let's do it again. It's like the Aaron Yeager meme where the guy who made bread, he's like, cook it again. <laughs> Uh, what a guy who invented gummy candies. Why is it just always inventors? I don't know. Why has it got to be inventors, Eduardo? Where's My Devin bed. on your list? Your wow. bed? <laughs> you left Devin out the top five? Yeah. You said your bed? My dad. Oh. Didn't Devin like save your life when you were a kid? No. Yeah, I almost did. killed him. No, what? yeah, yeah. <laughs> but like Devin said you were falling once and he caught you. Oh, and no, you he lied. Died. He's like, what? I never nah. fall. You never fall. I never fall. Then why are you stupid? You fell on your head. I was dropped. That's not, <laughs> that's not something that I had to do. <laughs> I, mean, I, 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 I didn't enough. fall. I was dropped and falling. Why don't you land on all fours? Yeah. Oh, my you bad. Ba-ding! I was asleep. Or just like land. Like, I'm not a cat. Time. <laughs> I'm not a cat boy. You are a femme boy. I'm not. <laughs> Some people say you look like a femme boy. With the beard and everything? Well, you barely have a beard. Okay. To lie for it's the two months. It's a two month work. How long have you grown yours out? Like a week. No shot. You've had that longer than a week. Maybe two. This has been a long ass week. If that's a week's, a week's work, a week or two. You forgot to shave at the beginning of the year. What? You forgot to shave at the beginning of the year. Me? Did I me? forget? You did not shave at the beginning because yeah, you told me you're like oh, I forgot. Yeah, and I did it the next day. He did. And then it grew back the same yes. length the next thing. Don't do that. Don't, don't be mad lie. because I'm Don't that guy. lie. You're lying. I don't know why you're talking about lying. Oh my. You're lying. God. I know that you're lying. You're lying. You haven't shaved. I have shaved. He shaved. Whatever. You can tell me what I did. Because I it doesn't look any different. Because that's how good I grow it. I guess he grows good. Yeah. yeah whatever. You don't know anything about that. What's this? I don't know. You have any more ideas? Do you have a story you uh, wanted to tell? He just said, what is this? I saw Peacemaker. Oh, yeah, you did see Peacemaker. I binged it all yesterday. Yeah. I did it. Yeah. Uh, you should. It's funny. I'm working on it. I didn't like it. You just though. said it wasn't funny. It's. I'm sure he'll find it funny. Like, there's moments where that True. were funny. I, I can definitely see it being Jose's humor. 
Mm -hmm. <laughs> Didn't you laugh out a poop joke? True. He did laugh at the poop joke. Like, I was like, there's got to be something funny. This is like the only funny thing that's happened this episode. Ha <laughs> ha. It was like the the first five minutes of the episode. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing funny had happened in the first five minutes. Uh, it's not supposed to. It was pretty like. Out of yeah. 45. Is the whole show just nonstop comedy? <laughs> that's Smiling Friends right there. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Smiling Friends is like joke after joke after joke. Like a majority fall, fall flat. But there's some funnies in there. That does not sound like a good show. It's not. <laughs> if they constantly fall flat, it's just sad. You should watch it. It's 11 minutes. Watch what? Uh, Smiling Friends. No. Isn't it like Happy Tree Friends? I never um, saw that, so I don't know. Oh, do you see that story of that one dude who got busted? Uh, I don't know how he got busted by the FBI, but I just saw the beginning of the story where he's like, how I got busted by the FBI. And he tells a story about when he was uh, 14, he used to have e-sex on AOL <laughs> with this girl. What the hell? <laughs> No. <laughs> so he just goes, he starts, he's like, you know, me, uh, they had like this, they were supposed to make this tree, this like, I don't know how the internet worked back then. It's like something where they're supposed to go to make like homework, do homework and study groups with each other. And he was like, you know us though, we're not doing that. We said <laughs> e-sex. So we met up with girls and we, we make a chat room and then they do e-sex basically. And then he was talking, all, he was telling, going into detail about what he did. It was kind of cringy and sad. I just thought it was funny that like How the top is he now? The top comments were always were like the first comment was like not even Batman could get me to tell this story. <laughs> <laughs> How old is he now? I don't know. He looks like a man our age, maybe. Damn. Oh no, if he's AOL, he's gotta be older. True, he has to be older if he's AOL. AOL. It's, like the... it's like you should have you know, played Emily's away. No. Oh. It's literally the Emily it's like uh no, but I have seen it. It's like the first like messaging system towards each other. Yeah, I don't know about that. It was like on Windows, like yeah. XP. Yeah, I didn't have the internet. Yeah, you did. Yeah, you did. You did. I know. You said you're 48 years old. What? Yes, you're a boomer. Yeah, you always like renegade, want to see it, then you're doing something else. How old would you consider a boomer, Eduardo? When you're like, that's a boomer. Like 42? <laughs> no. I, I don't like, know, cause I like, like my dad, my, I, I'm like, boomer. I was gonna go off my dad, cause he's like the oldest person I know, but he's that's not really like that much of a boomer. What? Let's say like 50, 60. Like realistically, it's not that. It's like way older, but like, like I 70? call them boomers if they're 40 and above. Oh. Maybe 30 sometimes. 30? Depending. Yeah, depending. <clears throat> Maybe 25. I'd say like 70 plus. 70 plus? Yeah. What you, Jose? I said 50, 60. But he calls you a boomer. That means he thinks you're 70 plus. You think I'm 70 plus? Yeah. You, got the, you have the old man glasses. You gonna let a 70 year old man outlift you? True. True. Yeah, ain't nothing I can do about that. He also has Harry Potter glasses. I just said that. You can let a man like that outlift you. Yeah. Look at his look at his chin shape. What about it? Gonna let a man like that outlift you? I guess. Ain't Have nothing. you seen the the turtle from Over the Hedge? <laughs> <laughs> What'd you do if you had that chin, Eduardo? <sighs> I'm sitting. That'd be sad. Did you live with your life? Did you be happy? No. <laughs> I shan't answer that. <laughs> Just answer it. It'll get, it will get to somewhere we don't need to talk about. Would you unalive yourself? Yeah. I'd despawn. That's that's, no, that's a bit. I'll despawn, despawn with no revives. That's a bit of an overreaction, don't you think? No. Oh. You know what I did enjoy about Peacemaker, though? I only liked one character. And it was Eagle. John Cena. No. Oh. You don't like John Cena in that show? He was funny. I won't lie. John Cena was funny. John Cena is I just funny. didn't like the character Peacemaker. John Cena is a good actor. He is. He, is. he actually is a good actor. I, I know. Was, that was crazy. I've seen his Because I've only seen him in like <sighs> Fast and Furious. I was going to say Hobbit Shaw, but he wasn't in it. The Marine. He is in Fast and Furious. And what? Right. The Marine. I've never seen that. The movie rounds. sucks. Never seen it. Movie sucks. No. <laughs> John Cena's <laughs> only good movie is like. What is this good movie? I don't know. Suicide Squad? Mm. <laughs> I never saw Suicide Squad. So it was like referencing. I, it was referencing Suicide Squad, and I was like, damn. Maybe I should have watched it and I would understand what's going on. I he's also in this one it. movie where he's like a drug dealer. I don't know what movie that is, but he's pretty good in that movie. He's a drug dealer? Yeah. Are you pulling up like John Cena's IMDb? No. Uh, what are you doing? Don't don't worry about it. You were scrolling Reddit? Dude, no. the guy who played Vigilante looked like iDubbs. Oh, uh, he's in Surf Sub 2. He kind of look like iDubbs. I haven't even seen the second one. The whole time I kept thinking, why is iDubbs in this? How did he get into acting? <laughs> like... I was telling Gabe about this. I actually liked Vigilante at the first time he was like being shown the first couple episodes. 
And then I stopped liking him because I just found him annoying. Like, my, the turning point of when I found him annoying was, like, after he got arrested. John Cena? No. Oh. Vigilante. I one of the characters. Know, I don't know who that is. He was cool in prison, though. True. Whenever Vigilante's fighting, he's he's just He's a monster. Raw. He's actual monster. <laughs> That's the, one thing I noticed about, like, the DC shows. Like, people with guns are just, like, ungodly. Uses. No, they're godly. Oh, godly. My bad. Yeah. They just, like, never miss. Unless, like, they have to miss. Unless I guess, they're, for the like, plot. the villain. <laughs> No, no, Peacemaker was the villain. Nah, enemies, and the my bad. Squad, he was, I like, not enemies. Missing. Yeah. Usually the guns, the the guns slingers, I guess, and DC are usually just amazing. Whereas seen. in Marvel, Blackwood is like trash. Is she? Basically. I haven't seen the Suicide Squad. The yeah. best Black Widow does is when she doesn't have a gun. When she's like... <laughs> yeah, when she's like flipping him. Somehow Hawkeye does better with a bow and arrow than she does with a gun. Let's go, Hawkeye. That's my boy. That's his boy. That's your boy. You should watch Arrow. Arrow's like Batman and Hawkeye. Oh, he's in Fred. The movie? Oh, yeah. John oh, yeah, Cena's Fred. Fred's Isn't dad. Like his dad? Yeah. 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 I forget. He comes out of the fridge and shit. I always forget that John Cena's in the Fred movies. That was before he was good, though. <laughs> that was when he was still in WWE. Yeah. Yeah, he's in the WWE uniform. Or his... His uniform? His so uniform. shorts? And like, he does wear cargo shirts. He wears shorts. And and hat. It's, not a, it's not a uniform. His, his, what, is, what do you call it? His costume? It's, it's, not like, <sighs> it's just clothes. His clothes. I Johnson guess. just wears clothes. I guess you could say his attire. His attire. He even like, wears like, like, like he, actual like low top sneakers. Because he, he just, just wears, wears what he clothes. he wears what he wore. He wears what he wears in WWE. He wore what he wears in the WWE. Yeah. That's what you're trying to say. Yeah, yeah. but it's still regular clothes. It'd be different if like he's like the rock came out in like his the rock attire yeah because that's not regular clothes i mean i guess john cena had his armband yeah he did yeah that's what he's saying his wwe attire oh mm -hmm. I but guess. that's the only thing he was known for at that point he wasn't an actor so they had to like market him as john cena yeah i always forget john i mean i would divorce fred's mom too she was crazy she was she like nora Who yeah nora from iCarly? Oh, okay. I don't know. That's like she started dating that. a vampire and all. Like an Nora? actual vampire? Yep. Vampires are real in iCarly verse. In the Fred verse. In the Fred verse. The yeah. Fred verse is connected to the iCarly verse. So I guess by connection, it's related into iCarly verse They're as well. They're real? Yeah, in the second movie, it's like Fred's like all scared about vampires because it's Halloween. He's trying to like blah blah blah. Coming to find out at the end of the movie, his mom's dating a vampire because you look at a mirror and there's no reflection and vampires don't have a reflection. So they can't face weird. themselves for what they've done or whatever that's the lore the reason. reason is. So that's the only reason we're thinking he's a vampire? What if it's just a fake mirror? <laughs> or if it's just a piece that? of glass? What if it's just a wrong piece of glass? They make it's it a point painted. that she's dating a vampire. Why? Because I don't know. That's the whole reason why he's like all upsetty spaghetti. Because my mom's dating a vampire. Would you really be scared of a vampire? No. Maybe. Unless he like shows his face to me, he's like, I'll kill you. And I'll be like, then maybe. Then Let's maybe I'll be scared. It's like midnight. <laughs> the dead of night. Knocking on your door. You like walk no, the door. No, because they can't enter unless I go well, come inside. That's not what I'm saying, though. Uh, <laughs> hold on. <laughs> walk on up. And he's like, he's like, what's up? And you, show, you see the fangs. He's like, let's chill. Let's yeah, like, kick back. Be like, <laughs> what? I mean, like, what? <laughs> He's like, mean? don't worry, I brought the booze. I'll be like, I'm booze. not of age to drink. <laughs> I'm not of age to drink. He's like, come on, stop the cap. I'm not capping. You know you want to chill. I'm good. Let's kick back. I know who you do want to talk to, my oh. boy, Jose. Oh. Oh. He's, al he's always down to drink. All right, Jose, midnight, vampire pulls yeah. up. He's like, he's like, let's kick back. Let's ah. get it. <laughs> So if you say no, I'm just gonna kill you. All right, all right let's get it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna kill you. If you say, ah, let's go. All right, well, he comes inside and kills you, Jose. You fell for his trap. He comes inside. You invited yeah. him in. You no, said, I didn't. You, he goes, you said, let's, let's go. Yeah, yeah, that's inviting him in. Yeah, no, said, I said, let's go as and let's go outside. Either no, way. He, <laughs> he said, let's kick back in your crib. He didn't say that. Okay, he didn't say the crib part, but let's but kick like, it. What do you he think said, that let's means? go. Let's kick it. I was like, all right, for sure. Let's go to the park. No, no you, didn't, you didn't say all that. He's right, went, you yeah. invited him in, and now you're dead. Better, can we rewind? No. No, because you know the outcome now. <laughs> <laughs> you're That's, spoiling yourself. I thought those superstitions were fake. What superstition? Vampires are fake, Jose. Oh, true. 
<laughs> like, what are we doing here? In this hypothetical where vampires are real, I thought the superstition was fake. No, if there's a hypothetical where vampires are real, then everything about them would be real. I mean, their weakness is they can't come inside unless you invite them inside. Mm, I didn't mm. think of that. I, that's have, what I just said. We don't said. have any silver, though. Although, I did plan ahead for this moment in this hypothetical situation. And I was wearing a uh, garlic necklace. <laughs> Oh, Do you so even he have smells it? He smells it. He's like, okay, he's smart. Let's go to your room. Let's take the party back to your room. What if and it's a female? By, female he, vampire. What do you do? Wait, because they're always hot. Hold on. As, <laughs> not bad. As he's walking through that hallway right there, he takes off his ring, flicks it, ricochets it, bounces it, hits my head. He's like, and I'm like, oh my god, what happened? So I come out I'm like, what's what's going on? He's like, Gabe. Get the garlic off of him. I'm like, for sure, bro. <laughs> <laughs> bro. <laughs> Cause you know me, I sleep with garlic already, so he can't get me. So I'm like, for sure. I like stink, snack your chain. <laughs> My chain. I'm like sniped. I. <laughs> what do you do then, him. Jose? You're he's watching. Like, he's like, thanks for show, and he like eats you. Little does he know. Oh, you have a contingency. Yeah. There's a, there's a secret. Uh, cabinet. Not a cabinet. There's a secret drawer. No, not a drawer. There's. Yeah, a I'm gonna be honest, with you, Jose. You're not faster than a vampire. What? You're not faster than a vampire. Yes, sir. You're not that guy. No, you're not. I stomp on the ground. <laughs> what? The whole <laughs> stomping on the ground. I'm gonna doing? Do Watch. <laughs> what does it do? There's Is a, it like a supersonic <laughs> stomp. There's a button on the spot where I stomped, and it causes the ground to shake. Right? Okay. Vampire loses balance, <laughs> falls. At the same time, the spot to my left opens up. <laughs> there's a cross inside. <laughs> I pick it up. Don't you have the Bible manga? Why don't you just like... You that doesn't not work. a real Bible manga. Oh. It's, it's also not the real Bible. Isn't What is it? It's a manga. Comic book Bible. Doesn't count. Oh. Okay. He's not going to be affected by it. Why not? <laughs> that, that's a fucking cartoon. That, he's going to be like, that's yeah. a fucking cartoon, stupid. <laughs> oh. Okay, continue. You have a cross. I got a cross. What do crosses do? So in the, middle, in the middle of you, like, pulling out the crucifix, I'm like, no, and I smack it out. Bro. I grab it, toss it. I thought, why'd you come back? <laughs> I thought a cross. I'm like, stop only... being a villain, Jose. A cro you, you're the one being a villain. <laughs> I thought a cross only works for how strong your faith is, not just the crucifix. Yeah, it is. So, well, Jose, so it's I guess in this hypothetical, Jose's like a, yeah. he's a devoted Christian, like in D&D. &D. Yeah. Okay. He's, the, he's his D&D &D character <laughs> in this situation. I guess. He's also reacting to a vampire, so clearly he's not this, the Joseph we know. <laughs> True. Uh, <laughs> you smacked the crucifix out of my hand? Yeah. What's next? I'm like, stop being a villain. And I go, no. Because in this hypothetical, I guess I scale to you. Right, and now? Now we're fighting. Naruto versus we're Sasuke fighting? Final Valley. <laughs> Naruto versus Sasuke Final Valley. <sighs> Where's the vampire? He's just watching. Because oh. I have to beat you so he can kill you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to fight Gabe. Just let me kill the man. Just I like, just want to go to sleep. I don't want to fight. Imagine how legendary that fight would be. Yeah, but right here in this in this scenario, I'm wearing a trench coat, right? What? And in the trench coat, a gun. A <laughs> silver bullet. I was about to say. <laughs> <laughs> So, Jose, you think you're grabbing the gun, pointing it at him, and shooting it before he gets to you? Yes. He is... He's watching, isn't he? He's in, like, breathing range of you. What, what are you doing, Jose? You're not that guy. I mean, if I reacted to him... Do you see him. how big this, this apartment is? It's not huge. He's not, like, across the hallway. He's in front of you. <laughs> so, I'm destined to hit him. Destined? No, yeah. you're destined to not even grab it in time. He's lobbing off your arm. What's next, Jose? All I have to do is grab off your arm and then boom, you're instantly like in pain. You're not even thinking about fighting back. No, I am. You're in shock. You went into shock. No. Straight up. Either. No. He lobs off your arm. You're like, uh, I, I go, uh, and I spit on it. What? What? <laughs> what? I spit on my arm okay. and then it heals. What kind of spit what? do you have? <laughs> who are you? Are you a mutant? Who are you? Yeah, who are you in this situation? You're not Jose anymore. <laughs> yeah, you are, this is not Jose. This isn't Jose. <laughs> What'd you do if you saw that? This is actually like Joseph. This ain't you. <laughs> You're actually a villain, then I'm taking you out. What? Bro, what? <laughs> I'm just trying to survive. I see you go, and then your arm starts coming out. I'm like, ah, oh, nah, he's gone. <laughs> gotta take him out. That's when, I, that's when I go back in my room. You come. You see me come back out okay. with a Batman attire. If you have, if you have healing capability, spit of spit that can heal. Why don't you just like heal yourself once you like are getting injured by the vampire? What do you think I just did? 
Well, yeah, so just let him quill, quill you, quote unquote, and just like spit. Like, if geez. he's dead, he can't. Hot kalugi on your hand, and he's like. Mm. I wonder if he's dead, he can't spit. That's why I'm saying strategically do it. So right. Strategically right spit up you, into the air. Right before you do die. the Goku shot when he didn't super, he's like he shot the thing in the air. Yeah. Exactly. You just spit, have it like launch in the air for like a year. Yeah. And then. No. And as soon as he oh, leaves, that, it just lands that's back a, on that's you. A something you can't do in this whole situation. Well, there's a ceiling. Okay, there's and a ceiling. Then don't Was his acid <laughs> shit gonna go through the ceiling? <laughs> it can land on the ceiling, right? And it can start dripping down on him. What if the vampire's like a snack and he starts nah, drinking nah, it? Nah, 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 nah. He has regenerative abilities. It's over. Oh. He's a vampire. He already has that. I didn't know that. <laughs> what? Well, you don't know. <laughs> that's like the re- main thing a vampires do. Is it? Yeah, yeah they're they immortal. regenerate. Oh. What if the cat starts drinking it? She becomes like Catwoman. Yeah, I'd be like, oh, okay, that's fine. I don't she care. Got, and then she like morphs into like. Catwoman. <laughs> uh, that's fine. I don't, I don't care as long as you can try to have sex with her. No, I didn't say that. <laughs> as long as she takes out the vampire, I don't. I don't care. You know, you're gonna see Catwoman right there, and you're <laughs> gonna be like, I don't want the. I don't want that. Yeah, I'm gonna say, take out the vampire. I'm about to die. <laughs> <laughs> you think she's gonna listen to you? Yeah. Cats like don't care about people. They only care about themselves. Cat gonna be like, what's the what's the vampire doing to me? You're like, next. I'm chilling. <laughs> Just be like, you're next if he kills me. Bro. And the vampire's like, nah, I'm gonna let you live. He's lying. Vampires lie. <laughs> they do lie, but I don't think Cat's gonna believe you. What did you do? Hypothetically, you're in, you're here too, Eduardo. Me? Great. Yeah, because he, he I'm following you. the vampire after yeah, I told him he like, okay. <laughs> yeah, he's oh, this was it, guy sounds cool. So yeah, you guys walk together. You're there too. <laughs> Who are you in this hypothetical scenario since a apparently spectator. we're all superheroes? You're a spectator. <laughs> No, yeah. what powers do you have? What, what are my powers? Uh, watching. <laughs> oh. That's pretty lame. I'm not gonna so you're lie. You're a woman writer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the vampire's like, all right, you're next to Wario for just watching. I'll be like, you should have joined the fight. What fight? Then he calls you a cuck. He like, said he wanted cuck? to see a tournament arc, <laughs> and you ruined it. I'll be like, how about this? 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 No. How about he makes you a vampire, Wario? I was gonna cool? ask that, but I was waiting for like this hypothetical to be done, and I was like, what? Would you become a vampire if you could? Like, let's say instead of him killing you, you turn into a vampire after y'all kick it. Yeah, sure. Why not? You'd want to be a vampire? Huh? You want to be a vampire? I don't see why not. You never go out in the daytime. That's fine. You'd have to always close your blinds, too. Uh-huh. Blackout curtains. Yeah. That's well, what I was what looking if, for. like, him? I'm in the living room? Huh? I can just effectively stop you from ever coming out to the living room. No. I'd be like, hey, get cucked, Jose. <laughs> the blinds are open. <laughs> Stupid. That'd be, I'd be like, bro. Or I just put like garlic in your doorway. <laughs> I'd be like, bro, what is this? <laughs> That'd be kind of messed up. It'd be funny. <laughs> I don't know what I would do. He's like, let's kick it. And I'll be like, yeah, sure, buddy. I've never kicked it with a vampire before. And I just turn into a vampire the next day. And he just dies you. What? He just dies you. Like, kills you. Like, it dies you. Yeah. Yeah, that's I think like... a vampire would be kind of cool, except I don't I don't like that I can't go out during the day. That's like the only I'll thing. be a day walker. We'll say hypothetically, I'm that guy, and I'm a day walker. Oh, yeah? Mm. I get the recessive gene of that. Yeah. Immune to the sun? Yeah. So while I'm day walking, chilling, I'm also immortal, <laughs> and can turn into a bat. You also pale. Not really. Yeah, you know, I'm a pale. daywalker. Do you know how many people I wouldn't are be pale? pale. Wait, no, I wouldn't be pale if I'm a daywalker. Is that why they're pale? I always thought it was they were just pale because they were just vampires. Eduardo, when someone says they need to get a tan, what do they do? I don't know. Go to a, a, a what's yeah. it called? A salon? Go, no, no. You when know, they say I'm gonna go to the beach and tan, what do they do? They go to the. What, what do you mean? <laughs> what, what do they? What what tans them at the beach? At the beach? I don't know the sand. You, d- are you, you, you don't believe that. You don't believe that. Why? You're, <laughs> what are you you're trying about? to be. A, you're trying to be anti here. You know what, what the answer is. <laughs> no, I don't. You know the answer is the sun. Oh, uh, the sand. <laughs> you yeah, don't the, believe that. The reflection capability. You're gonna sit here on, on this podcast and say you thought the sand tans them. Does it not? <laughs> <laughs> you did not think that. You just didn't want to admit how stupid you sounded. You, and then you end up making yourself st- sound more stupid. Yeah. How do you feel? But you feel stupid, don't you? Ah, crazy. Did you become a, a werewolf? No. No, I don't see why not. Maybe. What are the benefits of a werewolf? I don't you know. turn into only, a werewolf. I only remember, like, in Skyrim, you had the opportunity to be a werewolf or a vampire. I always went True. for werewolf. I think it was vampire. I never actually used the ability, though. Werewolf abilities. 
Let's see. Night vision. Like other supernatural creatures, they have extraordinary but super senses of sight, smell, and hearing. Okay, so like a wolf, it makes sense. They're fast. They can share thoughts with other werewolves. They have telepathy. <laughs> okay. Only with their own kind, though. What's this? Oh. Why is this a kid's website? I don't know. They can share thoughts. In Scandinavian Peninsula, they're often old women <laughs> with poison claws. Uh, they transform during a full moon. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. You can like rarely use it. Okay, you can only you can only do it when you it's a full moon. And I don't think you're you're not you're not immortal or anything. No, I think you're just a normal guy with like just heightened abilities. It's definitely a lot easier to avoid turning into a werewolf than it is to like live as a vampire. True. Because the full moon happens like maybe like twice a month or something. I believe so. So. You're chilling, and effectively the new moon shouldn't count because it's not a full moon, mm -hmm. even though it is, but it's not. You just chill, and if it ever is a full moon, you just look at the calendar and be like, "I, I just won't look at the moon today." Is it look? Or you don't have to. I thought it was once there is a full moon, that's when you transform. No, nah, you gotta look at it. You have to look at it because oh. if they're inside, it won't affect them. Is that what it is? I've seen that it's like it's the full moon tonight, and they just turn either way. Because I mean, they're like I've their bodies kind of doesn't affect them if they don't look oh, at it. Nah. I've seen both. I don't know which Let's one's canvas. How werewolf transform? Don't they just how? What? Or is it like a? Is it by force or like a what choice? Do you mean? Like a choice to become a werewolf? Their or transformation. I think it's werewolf forced. Titan transformation. <laughs> like do they, do they look at the moon? They're like, oh my god, I'm becoming a werewolf. Or do they look at the moon like, I want to become a werewolf. Oh my god. Oh, some werewolves weird. can also just be like triggered like the same way the Hulk is. If they get angry, if they get hurt, too much adrenaline. I think it's the oh no, I'm becoming a werewolf right now. So yeah, they can just do the Hulk thing and become a vampire. Uh I don't know. I don't wanna read this whole article just to find it. I'd become a werewolf, I don't see why not. Alright, vampire or werewolf, which one? Were you going all twilight here, Eduardo? Well, that's not what I was thinking that's of when I said French. that. I was thinking of Skyrim. No, you weren't. You never played Skyrim. So, yeah, sure, Twilight. You've seen the one? Twilight movies, haven't you? I have. Every single one. And he read the books. I have read not the books. read the books. And he I've follows Robert movies. Pattinson's career. You follow and Robert Pattinson's what's his name? Career. Jacob Sartorius? No. And uh, Caleb Taylor uh, and, Lautner. And, and, and Taylor we Lautner. had it. Taylor it is. And Taylor Lautner? Uh, the last time I've heard about Taylor Lautner, it was Shark he was, Boy. He was... Last time, that's before Twilight. You think he reverted in age? It's crazy. Twilight. I, I you followed what. him since Shark Boy and Lava Girl, and then Twilight made you the biggest fan ever, and you instantly were smitten with him. You were smitten? I don't even know what that Smitten? Mentioned. It was love at first sight, is what you told me. Very much. You were infatuated by him? No. You said so you were vampire or, or werewolf? <laughs> Red pillar. I think, we all, pillar. I think we already answered that. No, he said you haven't. He said werewolf. He yeah. just said if you could transform, you would, because you said the same thing to vampire. I think werewolf just seems more convenient. I could just like become werewolf if I want to, or I could just be human. That just seems more convenient. Whereas vampire, I'm always vampire. I'd want to climb a mountain as a werewolf. What? I'd want to climb a mountain as a werewolf. I mean, you could fly as a vampire. No. It's not as I think, fun. I think flying is cooler. <laughs> I'd rather fly or teleport. You guys said teleport, right? Yeah. Because they're weird. Flying is better. And I said teleport? Yeah. That's when I asked you guys about um, Goku's abilities. Would you rather have, like, of his abilities, what would you take? And you guys said instant transmission. I feel like I... Oh, yeah. True, 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 true. true. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's probably the only thing I thought of. I didn't think of flight as an ability. I mean, even still. Like, I'd just take key and I'd fly. That's all I'd use it for. Cause I'm, I'm not gonna try and be like Goku. I don't want to be Goku. I just want to fly. It'd be fun. It would be fun. It would be fun. Although the, it'd be a logistics nightmare to work to deal with. True. I'd have to wear like a suit. Nah, you'll be fine. Uh, that's why I would take an Iron Man suit. Like just take, just take a like jacket up there. Let's It'll go back okay. to the hypothetical, Jose. Where you're Iron Man, make me a suit. You would said you? you said he wouldn't let, in this hypothetical you'd be Batman and not let me make suits because I would be too much of a dangerous 
So what if I told? Yeah, so I told you that, right? And then I come to you the next day, and I'm like, Eduardo, make me a suit. I'd be, like, this a, I'd be like, this is a test, bro. No. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> you didn't fall for it. And I go, it's okay. You can make me one. Okay, what do you want? <laughs> you fell for it, and I break your kneecaps. I haven't made it, though. Why are you no, breaking you agreed, my kneecaps? No, you agreed, though, because you agreed to it. Because you, yeah. No, so I broke your kneecaps. Okay. What did you do if I, like, like, took your kneecaps out and, like, used it as a bowl for soup? I don't know. What do you want me to do? Oh, no. Can I have those back? Can I yeah. have that back? I mean, yeah. Okay. I say, oh, no. Can I have that back? You're not going to like be mad. I mean, yeah, but I kind of need it. Want it back. Okay. I only took one kneecap. Okay. You still have the other one. You I still, still want mad? it back. Why? Because you have the other one. So I still need the other one. For what? For this knee. You have, you have Tony Stark technology. Just make something else. Make a kneecap. Back. Make a mechanical Just give it kneecap. Back. Just make a mechanical Is that too much kneecap? to ask, like, for my kneecap back? Is it too much to ask for you to make a mechanical kneecap? True. Maybe. Yeah, that, that takes technology. Or you can just, like, put it back. I don't know who you think I am. I can't just, like, well, so slide it I don't back think in. who you are who just snatches it out. <laughs> no, I didn't say I'm snatching it you out. You just see it, like, I take your kneecap. I'm like, what? <laughs> yeah, I take your kneecap. I didn't and use it as I a just, bowl. like, snatch it out of your body. I could just, like, get a scalpel, sink, and then yank it out. I'll just, like grab it and like put it back in through that slice it's not gonna work like that because i like when i grabbed it out i'm sure it's like attached to a bunch of tendons and i just like tore it off of all those true I just put it back on we just like just yeah, like, like super glue back, back on <laughs> yeah I'm like doo -doo 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 -doo. I just put it back in my knee nah i think you just make a mechanical one just live without a kneecap dude <laughs> true like you still have your other one you could still play kickball i took your left kneecap not your right one great <laughs> Well, you need your left but, leg But for you it. want people to kick since you don't have a leg to balance on True. properly. <laughs> Unless you can balance without a kneecap. You can have one crutch. You got it. I guess. I guess. Like, do you, what do you even use your, lef, your left knee for, realistically? I don't know. It would be Nothing. nice to still have it, though. No, I mean, you don't use it for anything, though. Look, you, it's not even doing anything right now. Yeah, it's it just is. sitting there. It's us I'm using this le leg to bounce back and forth. Okay, then you so it's doing right nothing. No, so it's doing nothing. My right one's on the heel. It's bouncing. And that's your toes bouncing, Counter not your balance. knees. You're not like on your knees right now. Well, I gotta use my. All right. If I took your kneecap, would that make you straight legged? I think so. I don't know. Cause like, well, I guess it's only your cap. Your joint is still there. I don't know what the kneecap is connected to. If it's connected to anything. Let me see. Let me yeah, look me at the, Let me look at the skeleton leg. <laughs> Human anatomy. Human skeleton. You know what I've been playing a lot of recently? Uh, Lost Ark. Yes, sir. Surprisingly, first ever MMO I've played in a while. First, it was. I guess if that's supposed to be the kneecap, then that is the joint. So yeah, that was not bending. Ah. Ouch. You can't play basketball. I, okay. <laughs> you can't even. You're like sex would be weird for you. I guess with this You'd one leg like, that can't bend. Yeah, you just be like. I don't know, you'd be like that Spider-Man position. It's only <laughs> one leg could bend. It's <laughs> mm, a pretty good position, though. <laughs> so how do you feel about Lost Ark? I don't know. I'm, I'm enjoying it a lot. I haven't played an MMO in so long. The last one I played was like Lego Universe in middle school. Lego Universe. Yep. I know you said you played an MMO before. What MMO was that? Uh, I don't know. Let me think. What's an MMO? Massive uh, multiplayer. I've played a few, probably. Played Adventure Quest. Played. Uh, I don't know. I think that's probably it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I've played a Dragon Nest. That's one too. Dragon Nail? Dragon Nest. Uh, completely different. different. It's mm -hmm. better in every way. <laughs> Did you spend three hundred dollars on it? Spent zero dollars on it. Because oh. I'm a man. <laughs> you finally got to end game today. Uh, yes, not end game, but I got to level fifty, so now I can do like raids and whatnot. True. I did a raid yesterday. Did you? Uh, yeah. Oh, of course. So now I can scared. do guardian raids. Uh, raids in general. Are you talking about uh Lost Ark? Yep. Lame. Made a guild. Got four people in it so far. Three, four, I guess, counting me. You don't count. 
All right, so I got three people in it so far. Who's the third? It's Tyler, you, and Ash. Oh, what about um, Eddie? I doubt Eddie's gonna want to play an MMO. Jose. Jose. What about me? Would you play? Yeah, I'll join. Okay, you gotta play it. No. Okay. <laughs> no, I'll just be there in name. Cool. True. Oh, uh, I'm, I'm I'm gonna say, did you see it? But I know the answer is no. <laughs> so, did you see this white dude who would like his 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 wife had a black daughter? I he saw got, that. He said, "Turns out my wife has a rare recessive <laughs> BIPOC gene." She told me how the science works. When I saw she was black, nature is amazing. Oh, it's a recessive gene. Bro, really fell for that. He said she even got the DNS the DNA test to prove that it was hers. <laughs> that was hers. <laughs> yeah. It's my baby. Look. That's 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 upsetting. That's real sad. <laughs> Imagine falling for that. Maybe he doesn't actually believe it, but he just wants to like believe in it because he doesn't want to accept the fact that his wife cheated. Why why post about it then? I don't know. <laughs> why why do you want the world to know that? I don't know. I think he's just proud of it. I think he like genuinely believes she's black, <laughs> or she has the B I P O C gene. What the hell does B I P O C stand for? What do you uh, think? I'm guessing P O C stands for person of color. Black integral. I don't know. Black mm -hmm. integer. Black integer person of color. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. So you know, uh, you know Tyler has his like uh. Is a nubs notification. Yeah. So we're thinking about this. Whenever I say some like some facts, it's just like it's like basically words of God. It's like the gub gospel. Kind of Lydio's. Not gonna lie. <laughs> the gub gospel. Not gonna lie. What Jose? It's kind of got a ring to it. It's kind of exactly. funny. Exactly. It goes hard. It's pretty funny, yeah. We couldn't think of anything for you, Eduardo. The only thing that came up was like Eduardo ejaculation. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> it was either that or like the Eduardo eavesdropper. I just heard, <laughs> <laughs> but it's just things that you already knew. Because we we're doing like a a what if if the the joke group wasn't on the Illuminati Council, like what each of our titles would be. I think they said Jose was the Harbinger. Jose, <laughs> Harbinger. You were the, yeah, you're the ejaculator, Eduardo. <laughs> nice, you know, that's my title in the Illuminati is that I ejaculate. I can't remember what Tyler's was. Devin was the uh, maestro menace, probably, I think. That is what he calls himself. Or the Devin dictator. Devin dictator? <laughs> There's a man coming. Ooh. No, that's what a harbinger does. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you're the Jose Harbinger. Where's someone coming? Jose, has a, better, Jose has a better place on the panel than you do. Thank Let's you. go! Imagine being the ejaculator of the group. I don't, I don't even... I, I guess. Oh, Eddie gets to be the educator. Yeah. Eddie, the educator. The ed educator? That's what I was thinking a second ago. You're not the educator. Okay. You don't educate anyone. But I'm the ejaculator. Anything you take away. You, you are the ejaculator. <laughs> you're not the educator. Yeah. Can't change your title word unless you think of something better. There isn't. <laughs> All right. Whenever you talk, it's just Eduardo Exposition. <laughs> Exposition, Eduardo. It's not a title. Expositionary, Eduardo. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Homeless Jose. No. <laughs> I have Homeless a Jose. I, okay. <laughs> Let's not do that. <laughs> Yo, I heard that you guys got an air dryer. Not an air dryer, an air fryer. We do get an air dryer. We dry things with the air. What are you guys going to do with your air fryer? Oh, and then Devin said it's a maestro message. What? A maestro message. I guess. It? So it's what are you guys like planning to do with something. your air dryer? Air fryer, my bad. Probably put your mama in it. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking nerd. Uh, <laughs> Get rolled. What? Bitch. Uh. Oh, but like, I'm probably gonna make food with it. Like what? Like, like the stuff that I eat. <laughs> you know, like when you're hungry and you like eat food? <laughs> <laughs> That's probably what I'm gonna do with it. 
What's your, what's the first thing you're gonna fry in it? <laughs> Probably something I can eat. Like what? <laughs> but uh, some kind of food. Yeah. Something for sure that I I can digest. <laughs> cool, cool. Like what? Um, you know, Chicken, like food. Fries. You ever had food before, Wardo? Uh, no. Okay, well I'm gonna have that. Uh -huh. What is yeah. food? You're it's like out. this thing you like put in your mouth. <laughs> Not a dick. I know that's the only thing a Wardo knows goes <laughs> in his mouth. No sir. That and water. I mean, I've never seen you drink water. To be honest, I think it's a myth. Honestly. <laughs> Me drinking water is a myth. Yeah. Oh, you get a sweet tea. Yeah. What if we had a dude named Walter? He'd be the water drinking Walter. And he's forced to only drink water. Doesn't sound bad. You don't even know what the Illuminati Council is, Eduardo. So why are you mad at being the ejaculator? <laughs> Such a dumb name. Such a dumb <laughs> title. What do you mean? It's not supposed to be menacing or anything. You're on the Illuminati. Just be happy. That's my grub, my gub greeting to you. Gub greeting. <laughs> Do not fret over your name. Just be happy. And that's words from the gub gospel. Mm. <laughs> what? Yeah, it's funny. I know, it's funny. It's a funny title. What? The, the gub, gub gospel? The gub gospel. <laughs> it is what it is. Can't be helped. What? Nothing. What are you doing? Yeah, what are you doing? You're just beating your thigh. Me? Yeah, you, no, I'm, I'm looking chilling. at you. I'm chilling. What was that about? What was that thing you were watching, Jose? What thing? On your phone. On my phone? You want, you want to tell the story you were holding on there? I was watching something. Are you, aren't know. you always like on Reddit or TikTok? Yeah. And like a story on Reddit you want to share? No, there's nothing. Well, mm, actually, there's nothing. on r slash green text, I just what found a that? post of what is r slash green text people no. texting people with androids no stupid all right what is it do you know what 4chan is i've heard of it okay that's enough <laughs> <laughs> there's this compilation of pictures from a thread of people reacting to this man having c cup moves <laughs> and straight up they look just like a female's, but it's got hair. And everyone's like, bro, put a timestamp on that. It's got to be fake. And he's like, okay, I guess. And everyone's freaking out about it. Put a timestamp on it? Yeah. You know how like people write their usernames on like pieces of paper to show that they're real and stuff. Yeah. It's like the same thing. Put like a date time and then take a oh, picture okay. of it, post it. See, look at that. Ew. Ew, yeah. That is so weird to look at. Because <laughs> I thought I was expecting someone fat, and he yeah. doesn't look that yeah. fat. He doesn't, no. And start off with him like, yeah, I like wearing this rootless, uh, it's a pink holder. It keeps everything from moving. What? Is he trans? No. <laughs> Are we sure? Uh, I think I'm pretty sure. Did he I, say I he was here? Thing. Yeah, everyone's like, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he just hits chest day. <laughs> he just never does protein so it just didn't fill out i don't know dude <laughs> yeah, that was just fucking weird dude yeah i don't know anytime i'm on reddit because i follow r slash nice guys and r slash nice girls i always get like secondhand cringe from when i read them that's just how it is like you said that, like twice a, a week because yeah that's the only that's the only interesting thing i see on reddit <laughs> i always see jose on her no. I always see Jose's number. You know, like, oh my god. You should go to r slash creepy asterisks. What is that? You go to r slash watch people die. Is watch people up? die inside. Or like people fucking dying. Yeah. You know what happens to that subreddit? Oh, I couldn't guess. No, you couldn't. No, you couldn't. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> Which one? Uh, people fucking dying? People. People. Did you know, Jose, did you know that e-girls don't want to be called e-girls anymore? I think I've heard this one. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one Devin tried saying. <laughs> I was going to see if you forgot it. <laughs> you didn't hear about it? <laughs> I was like, oh, really? And then I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I've heard this somewhere before. 
<laughs> nah, you have it. Okay, what do they want to be called? <laughs> Dude, they're called eye ladies. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. They want to be called what? You heard me. I didn't. <laughs> Not funny to say. <laughs> I know. You swear you're that guy. I don't. I don't swear, dude. In general. Oh Thank wow, you. you're right. This is not what I was expecting from r slash people fucking dying. Told you. Told you. You always think that's what you get for thinking you know everything. I didn't. I just said I could have guessed. <laughs> I guess it was wrong. But these are cute though. Cute animals. What? Uh, there was a post about an animal. It was a cat hugging a dog. Oh, word of Remember we watched Batwoman? I wasn't there. Oh. I was there, but I wasn't watching it. You mean you were there? I was playing Lost Ark while y'all were watching Batwoman. You were there? Yeah. That was yesterday. No, it wasn't yesterday. It was two days ago. Oh, okay. Why? <laughs> uh, Why bring it up? <laughs> I mean, you weren't there. There's no point. I was there. You weren't. You weren't paying I attention. I saw, like, the last ten minutes of it, I believe. Because, uh... Did you like it? Uh, no. <laughs> Oh, Devin liked it. Did he? Yeah, he liked he liked it a bit. He wanted to finish it. Is he excited what? for the new season? <laughs> he said it's better than Big Mouth. And Let's go. That's a pretty low bar. <laughs> yeah, he we he likes Big Mouth a bit. He watched like three seasons of it. More than me. True. It's more than me as well. Oh, this is Devin. You like Rick and Morty? Oh yeah, we we watched the Cuphead show yesterday too. Oh uh, damn, did y'all? I saw the yeah. first episode today when I woke up. You were supposed to be there, but you like it ditched. I was OD'd, remember? I was OD'd. Ditched. You decided to be fake, and you're like, I, I'm gonna ditch the boys. <laughs> True. I'm not fans of them. Ain't nothing I could have done about it. What is the Cuphead show? It's a show about. Cuphead. You know the game Cuphead? Yeah. It's basically about that, but it's like made for kids. Who's that? Uh. Looks like Mia Malkova. It's not. Let me see. <laughs> it's a. Uh, Let me see. Don't say the name. B T G. Don't say the name. Let me see. What? What the fuck is that? Oh. Why is she blonde? She dyed her hair. She's not supposed to be blonde. Isn't she like goth? Isn't she like four two? True. Yeah. She's really short. She had that one video of her like opening her freezer and she was standing under her fridge and just opened right over her head. That is what? tiny. What is? Your audio just like cut off or you're just not talking in the mic. Like, Bro. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why'd you run back? away from the mic? Huh? Why'd you run away from the mic? Don't I, was, I was wondering why I like, couldn't hear what you were saying. Man, you were scrolling Friday and I went. I was curious. <laughs> I wanted to see what was going on there. Look, I'll read an expert excerpt from r slash nice guys. Why? Because it's on here. Actually, nice guys or nice girls? I do not care. Mm, yeah, there's more people in nice guys. Okay. So. My friend posted an ad on Facebook to find a roommate for her apartment. This guy is 20 plus, uh, duh, 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 this was typed out a while, 20 plus older than her and says all of this. The guy says, hi, my name is blank. I think you're adorable and would love to meet you. Uh, good morning, blank. So what do you think? I know it sounds weird, but let's meet at five points pizza for lunch or dinner if you want or any anywhere you want to go. What do you think? I'm in, I'm in blank now. I'm really, I'm a really nice guy and will treat you like a lady yeah, should be treated. You said it. He said the thing. And then the girl responds with, sorry, I'm not interested. And he goes, I am so disappointed. Listen closely and you can hear my heart being torn apart. I know it's tough to, to put your trust in someone you don't know, but every relationship has to start somewhere. When I saw your face, my heart just melted. At least I had one day where my hopes were up. That we could at least meet, possibly grow from there. I'm here if you should have change of heart. Blank, I have so much to offer to you. Love, affection, security, devotion. And if you find it in your heart to give me a chance, you can 
you can come live with me in his address you won't need to find a roommate and i already take care of and i already take care of the bills look if you're gonna read a reddit post you gotta be able to read eduardo uh, you're I, not made for that that's well, not your job next one. i'm not good at that don't well, don't say next one. got yeah, female i female 36 have been with my boyfriend for a male 41 for two years he has three kids six twelve four while I have a 16 year old son. The other day, my 12 year old stepson fell off the stairs and injured his ankle. <laughs> his dad and I had to go get him to the hospital and he needed to stay with someone while the kids were there. My boyfriend told my son to skip work day and stay with, uh, stay with and watch his stepbrothers. When we returned, my son asked my boyfriend to pay him for babysitting his kids. I admit my son doesn't have the best relationship with his stepdad or step siblings, but my boyfriend and I were shocked by this. My son explained that he had to skip a work day which caused him to lose money, and he asked my boyfriend to pay for him on this time. My boyfriend scolded him harshly and told him that staying home with his stepbrother isn't babysitting and he deserves no money for it. Plus that skipping one day of work won't do much harm. My son disagreed, kept arguing. <laughs> yada yada, disagreeing. Um, she agreed with her boyfriend and punished the son for asking for payment. What do you think? She in the wrong? I was not even reading. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Bro read the whole thing you didn't hear anything no i was reading this <laughs> it says my little sister on this guy on snap because he no, said no one I wants to hear what you gotta say eduardo you're fake <laughs> that he what do you think get say? to know me honestly gabe i can't believe it i got fake people on <laughs> read it again, <laughs> read it again. I'm sorry. i i, I, I don't i only it. heard bits and pieces cause read I'm, it again i'm, oh I'm busy God. making my reddit avatar <laughs> All my homies fake. Apparently, girls don't like being called beautiful Bro. nowadays. This, this is why I need you're Tyler not. You're pretty back. ugly. Was just being nice. Never tied this on the episode. He doesn't. He doesn't not listen to me. <laughs> <laughs> he listens. And why love, don't you guys? Listen? I love when Tyler's on the episode. Same. We're not the same. Ever since Tyler left, everyone just like ah, we hate Gabe. <laughs> Have you ever been on R slash Am I the asshole? That's what, what I just read off of. I thought you were reading off of nice guys. <laughs> no. That's why he asked, what do you think? Is she wrong? Oh, what'd she do? <laughs> <laughs> Basically, TLDR. Uh, <laughs> there, there's usually a TLDR at the bottom, isn't there? Is there not? There's not. No. Oh. Oh. Just read it all again. No. Basically, um, her, they have steps, they have stepson. And step siblings, I guess. I don't know how, but they do. And I don't know, man. It's confusing, honestly. I don't even. I'm like kind of confused by the situation. <laughs> That's why I said read it again. I don't want to read it again. Instead of giving it's it TLDR. No, it's confusing. Okay. And it's tiring to read again. Refusing to pay the babysitter for new glasses after I broke my daughter's old ones. Hmm. What do you think? Refusing to pay the babysitter for new glasses. That is weird. Why would she not do that? Mm. If your daughter broke them, you should pay for it. Yeah. I want to see what's her reason for why she said she won't do it. I was going through old screenshots. I remember asking him not to send sexually charged messages and getting this in response. I'm going to keep being me. And if you don't find me attractive, you don't know how to flirt. And you, get, you got low sex drive, then I don't want my time wasted. I'm the best you'll never have give the i give the best head i fuck better than anyone you'll ever meet goodbye i'm gonna keep doing me hun and uh this guy you can see bits of him in the background what a man yeah what, what he has think? an acne scar on his face that looks like a heart Ooh. this guy that i just read off of this one that's crazy oh uh -huh. <laughs> i thought it was kind of neat So basically, her reason for why she shouldn't have to pay for it is because it was an accident. So, so she's like, no. An accident her daughter caused. Yeah. Makes no sense. Kind of weird seeing people, like, try and justify themselves for, like, not doing common courtesy. Were you the one who told us about that one post where this girl was, like, obviously in the wrong and she went to Reddit to post about it? But yeah, she, that was funny. Was like it? this, Do you remember this what it one was? girl where, yeah, she was absolutely in the wrong, but she originally posted it in r slash relationships. To see what they said and they all said she was wrong so she deleted it and posted it into the other subreddit and they were and the top comment was you're not slick i saw your post in the in our slash relations we told you you're wrong there we're gonna tell you you're wrong here do you remember what she did uh i think i have it bookmarked but it was like it was like menaces. it was so weird that she even thought anyone would agree with her it didn't even make sense 
I don't think I have it archived. Actually. Oh, that's sad. I remember reading that. I'm like, bro, who does she think she is? I mean, how do you even check your archives, Jose? Uh, archives. What do you mean? Like you can like archive posts. Let's see. You can bookmark posts. Save. Here it is. Yeah. Uh, this one. Yeah, it was. It was the one where she was sleeping over at her boyfriend's house and like using all the stuff, and she didn't pay. She she called it sleeping over, but she really just lived there. Oh yeah, yeah, with the roommate. Yeah. Yeah, I remember that. Cause they all thought it was funny. Like, why are you calling it sleeping over, bro? You live there. <laughs> if you're there like every day, she she goes to her parents' house like on the weekends. I would I would say you're sleeping over at your parents' house. Yeah. Wait. That's weird. Doing something alone is sad, but doing it solo is cool. Yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's just doing something alone is sad, but doing something solo is cool. Yeah. I can get down with that. Yeah. So you know, I'm gonna listen, I'm gonna I'm gonna go I'm gonna go walk alone, or I'm gonna go walk solo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna play Fortnite alone. I'm gonna play Fortnite, Fortnite solo. solo. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. True, just sounds different. Oh, shit. <laughs> I can get jiggy with that. You can always find some cool stuff on Reddit. I just found r slash recipes. What does this even mean? You weren't picked last. You just weren't picked. You joined the second team by default. True, I guess. <laughs> yeah. You weren't picked last, you were just never chosen. I don't know if that's better though. <laughs> what? Is that really no. better? No. What is that? It's this guy using a, a um, finger skateboard. And he's doing some cool tricks. That's all you <laughs> see. That's all that's important. Look, look at this game. Men coming fast is an evolutionary advantage. Oh, he's skeezy with it. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, she got a. Thick. Yeah. <laughs> What'd you say? I said she kind of thick. No, that before that, what were you reading up? Men well, coming like fast is an evolutionary advantage. Uh, yeah. I don't see how. I don't see how either. If your identical twin died, what's the evidence other than your word that you're not him? Social security what? number? Yeah. Birth certificate? Is this guy just not heard of that? What, what does the answer say to this? I'm missing an eyeball. Oh. Okay. I guess. <laughs> I suppose. I mean, it's oddly specific, but. Yeah, okay. that only works for you. My legal documents. <laughs> My mother. Maybe. Actually, no. You could just show your, your brother's documents and then. That's not the best way of showing that you're you. Yeah, I guess not. Huh. I guess there really is no other way. There's no way to prove that you're you and not your twin brother. I mean, their genetics are different. So I would think the doctors DNA could test? tell. Yeah. Because, like, they're twins, but they're not clones. Yeah. So I, I think a better question is, if a clone of you died, how do you know it was the clone or mm -hmm. you? You couldn't. Unfortunately. And I guess it would depend on when the clone of you is made. Because if you know when the clone of you is made, it could determine... You guys would eventually diverge mm -hmm. into different paths. And does your clone have your memories? Yeah, that's what a clone would do. <laughs> it's a clone of you. Yeah. So? You really tried to be, like, deep there, but it was, like, it was so shallow. I thought, I, I thought it was just a clone, like, in appearance. <laughs> no. I was like, oh, it just looks like you, but it's empty. <laughs> How does it move? If it's empty. It's not like empty physically. I mean like empty like factory reset, you know? So it's gonna be like Google Gaga? Yeah. <laughs> you stupid Jose. <laughs> Do we know who the clone is, Jose? The other one's going Google Gaga. <laughs> <laughs> you really tried something there. You thought you were something. You thought you ate. <laughs> <laughs> Jose you thought he ate <laughs> I'm going TikTok. Yeah, he's, he's trying to be deep, and he's ended up being <laughs> going on TikTok. But if man. you opened your mind, <laughs> will this clone be me? Or the guy I who could be, be me? If, I, if I'm me, me. <laughs> is it a clone or a copy? <laughs> 
I guess we'll never know. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's like the only argument to like not wanting clones because I think everyone wants to have a clone so they can do like other stuff. Mm -hmm. The only argument to not having a clone is like, what if he just like kills you and tries to take over your life? Yeah. I'd kill him first. <laughs> you, you guys think the same. So something you not do, me. you would probably think of it as well. <laughs> yes, not me. No, sir. Are the same. Not me, me. <laughs> you guys yeah. are the same, Jose. <laughs> no, he's a clone he's a of you. I'm Jose. built different. He's built the same he's as built you. The same as you. I'm if built, you're built different. different. If you're built different, built... so is he. No, okay. He gets cloned, right? And then I get built different. <laughs> How? <laughs> That's not what built means. That'd be like rebuilt. <laughs> I get rebuilt different. <laughs> no. Why do you automatically change as soon as you make a clone? <laughs> Is that your so I can win? Yeah, so I can win in this hypothetical. How are you gonna? How so, you that's gonna a, so that's your thought process. As I know what's I'm, coming. So what do you think he's thinking? He's you, Jose. He knows your thought no. process. No, 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 no. Yes, he does. No, 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 no. <laughs> Jose, he's literally you. No, see, okay, I also planned for that. He would know that. He's no, he you, wouldn't. Jose. no, he wouldn't. Everything you think no, of, see, he thinks that's of the too. Thing. That's the thing. I get the men in black pen, right? What? <laughs> what? I flash myself with it. I clone myself. You know I... how the men in black pen works? Yeah. It's only recent memories. It's I not know. like forever. I know. You still have the same thought process, Jose. He'll still come to the same mm -mm. thought you came to. He won't. Yes, he would. No, he won't. Why He's not just you, use it? Because I wouldn't even think of it. Why not you, use it you on the of it clone? Right now. No. Why not use it on the clone instead of yourself? That's what he's saying. He's saying he'd do it on himself before he makes the clone. No, like if so he'd the, forget clone, the, if the clone is trying to attack you, because obviously you for some reason have this pen, just do that and he will forget the fact that he wants to attack you. And then he'll remember. Then what? <laughs> It's what the same the? thing with you saying you'd erase your memory before. You just didn't think of it. Nah. Just because he forgot it briefly doesn't mean he just won't think of it again. He's still you, Jose. It's not your twin. This is literally you. He thinks the exact same way you okay, do. There's okay. nothing you okay, can okay. do that he hasn't already thought of. To be fair, I'm pretty predictable. So, I know what I'm going to be doing, right? So, what are you going to do that's so unpredictable? Nothing. So you're and you're you're doing nothing is what you're gonna do that's unpredictable. Yeah, and he'll know that because he's you, Bro. <laughs> Jose. He's literally you. Nah, I don't know who you think nah, you're. You're trying I'm to the... fool. You're fooling yourself. It's not possible. I think it's possible. You think the exact same way. Unless you just start t thinking like drastically different, like someone else. Unless like you made this clone and immediately like sent him to MIT or something, so he's just smarter <laughs> than you. <laughs> Like there, he'll think more advanced than I will. <laughs> That's my advantage. He's smarter. <laughs> or you, you make the clone and you instantly go to MIT. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm the smart one. And then he sees you go to MIT and he follows you. I'll be like, bro, why are you here? <laughs> You guys are the same. He thinks that if you think it's a good idea, he thinks it's a good idea. Nah, that's stupid. It's not a good idea. That's go what back. you think. <laughs> you how, are you gonna you how are you going to convince yourself to not go to MIT? It's how could you affix How could you lie to yourself? I don't think it's possible. <laughs> you know your own giveaways. I don't. You do. I don't. You do. You Subconsciously, know you, you know your own lies. If you was a clone of yourself, you could not lie to yourself. Maybe after like a select amount of time, if you guys diverged and lived your own lives and get your own mannerisms, yes. But like freshly made clone, you could not lie to yourself. Subconsciously, you know your own tells, regardless of if you can surface them. You know your tells and you'd never be able to lie to yourself. You could try, especially the fact that you guys are the same person. What, what lie is he telling you that you like would believe? There's someone behind you. Oh my God. <laughs> Cause you can't be like you can't be like I w when I was a kid I was seven or something you'd be like okay I was too I'm you like stupid uh, that's lame man I don't want a clone anymore <laughs> that's what I'm saying that's the biggest drawback to having a clone is you have to deal with that uh, I don't want to deal with it that's why the best the best clone technique is just shadow clone they're just obedient. Because they have to be obedient to the master, otherwise he'll just disband them. Yeah. He'll be like, nah, you done. But like, you're done. That stupid dummy boy. What? So would you want to deal with that clone situation, Eduardo? No. You you wouldn't trust him to like, nah. to be obedient? No. Why? Because he's you? Yeah. <laughs> Do you know you're a disobedient? Exactly. Because you're a Sundar. Right? I think it'd be funny you Shut trying up. to deal with another one of you. That'd be funny. That'd be annoying. Yeah, for you, but it'd be yeah. funny for us. 
<laughs> yeah, loser. Look at the wardo. <laughs> Look at Drew. He has to deal with his own mannerisms. You'd be like, dude, I literally know you're lying. And the other one's like, no, I'm not. I'm not. You know that's you are. Even yeah. when we know you're lying, you still act like you're not. And I was like, I'm not lying. I'm like, I'm literally you. I know you're lying. <laughs> He's like, okay, you say you're me. But are I'm you? I'm like, me? what do you mean I say I'm you? Where you? I'm you. I made you. I'm your creator. You're not my dad. That's not what I said. <laughs> you didn't nut in my mom. What? <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Be a funny argument. Yeah, bang! I deal with myself. He'd think the same thing, and he would he'd have, he'd have gun too. Okay, like, then we're just we're trading. Both pointing at each other. You guys trading? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> That'd be kind of crazy. Oh my god! Then that's when Devin steps in. He's like, "No," and he saves your life. And then you ask why he saved your life. He's like, "No, he... Eduardo, look at me. This isn't you. Look at me. <laughs> You're not a murderer." And he's like, oh, "I'm not." <laughs> Except this one time. No. <laughs> Why'd you just become racist? What? No, so not Devin. Except this one time. Nigga, nigga, nigga. No, nigga, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> it's kind of racist. No. <laughs> That's what I mean. Nah, you, you said the N word. No, I sure. didn't. No, yes, what? Yes, you did. I did not. No. I think I think me and my co have the same understanding. We'd be like, all right. none of No one here is the master. We just equally help each other. Mm-hmm. I think we would have a good understanding of each other, and we would we wouldn't try and kill each other because unlike Jose, I'm smart enough to understand he's me, and I'm not gonna <laughs> beat him. Unlike Jose, thinking he's somehow gonna outsmart himself. <laughs> I'm out here fighting my clone to the death. The only shot you have of beating a clone of yourself is if it's been like years since you guys separated, because then you guys would have different mannerisms. But if it's like too fresh, you guys think the same. No shot. So I'd make a clone. I'd be like, I right, you go to like this like I don't know third world country. I'll stay in America for a year and then we'll see who's better. And I'll win, of course. Third world <laughs> country, he's not gonna have anything. Mm -hmm. What if he learns how to survive out there? Well, then he's like street smart, I guess, more than me. But I'm book smart. I'm I'm strategizing him. Like stupid. What's two times four? Yeah. Is that how I win? <laughs> yeah. Does he just forget like <laughs> simple math? Yeah. I mean, when you're out surviving, you don't really think about math. Maybe he's gonna be like, I gotta keep up with math. <laughs> how many berries do I have? I have two piles. Yeah. And what if five he... berries in each pile? Exactly. What if he starts doing like the kindergarten stuff we learned? He starts making a multiplication table mm -hmm. out of sticks. He's like, I know Gabe. He's gonna test me. Exactly. <laughs> he knows himself. G what Gabe is thinking right now is like he's thinking I'm focused too much on surviving. Little does he know I got this whole down. So I'm street smarter than him, but I gotta get book smart. And that's it's gonna be kinda hard over here. I know Gabe's gonna be riding on the fact that I'm not gonna be book smart, but I'm gonna be book smart. Okay, that was the one. Right, okay. So there's it's like you're you're living in the multiverse theory here. So you can go you can go to a multiverse and grab other versions, but it ha the rule is you can only grab people that you know in okay. your timeline. So we can't just go like multiverse and go grab like uh, Ryan Reynolds or something. Mm, but I know Ryan Reynolds. And the rule in the game is it's like a it's like a tournament. Remember the how do I explain this tournament to anyone? It's like you remember the tournament I told you guys earlier, like a couple weeks ago, like the the like Squid Game thing. No, it's like months ago. Yeah. Basically like that. Did I ever say that on the podcast? No. no, I don't think so. Okay. Basically, imagine Squid Game, but it's like a team game. Mm -hmm. And you get to grab two teammates from multiverses. So you could theoretically grab yourself if you wanted to. Okay. Who would you grab? Because think about it. You're, you're, the people you're versing is us, is the seven members of, of uh, Joe. We can all, we all have the same rules. We can all grab multiverse people too. Okay. So if I can do that, can I go to someone who knows someone who knows someone? No. If it has to be you. Okay, I was so gonna, I was gonna say I'll go, go grab Devin, but you can't grab that Devin and be like, all right, Devin, who do you know? You I was gonna that. be like, because I know, because I met Gabriel Iglesias once. So I was like, I'll go to Gabe, Gabriel. You, don't, you met him. You don't know him. I know him. You have to know we them. Knew can't just meet them. What's he gonna do in the competition? He's gonna know Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart knows The Rock, so I was gonna bring The Rock. <laughs> no, you have to know them, not just meet them. No, I know the guy. We spoke. <laughs> Hey, how you doing? Oh my god, I'm a big fan. Yeah, we have yeah, a parasocial relationship. We with sat him. down for a point. Yeah, I know Connor. I listen to his streams. <laughs> I know him. Yeah, we sat down for a point and we were like, oh, what's it like being a comedian? He's like, ah, jokes. And I was like, ah. For sure. 
Yeah, we exchange contact information. Okay, so who'd you grab? Hmm. <laughs> I'm taking Gabe and Tyler. Man, that's what I said. So I'm grabbing <laughs> another Gabe. I'm having two Gabes. And I'm grabbing that Tyler. <laughs> yeah. I, that is like the best play. Is that just the God Squad is the Gabe Tyler? Yeah. Great. Like if I go into another verse, I can't be like, all right, give me Battle Hard and Devin. I mean, I'm not grabbing Eduardo. Yeah, yeah. no one's grabbing you, Eduardo. I'll exactly. be honest with you. I'm not grabbing Maybe you. Maybe Eddie, but we're not grabbing you. Why Eddie? Because no. he likes you. He'd yeah. be like, I need to have some fun in my in my team. He has Devin. No. I don't think he'd grab Devin. He would definitely grab Tyler. I think everyone in the group would grab a Tyler at least. Mm -hmm. There's definitely a Tyler being taken. Uh, Jose, you're definitely not being taken. Like I said, I'm not going to go into a multi. I'm not going to go into a. I'm not getting. Deck. I'm not getting myself. Give me the like. People who's not like gra getting grabbed is Eduardo, Eddie, and Jose. Nobody's yeah. taking them. Like, give me Battle Hard and Devin, who actually went into combat. <laughs> and then Tyler. And then yeah, Tyler. Nine so finger Tyler, not oh, so ten finger off. Tyler. The ten finger Tyler. Yeah. I want ten I'm finger getting, Tyler. I'm getting ten finger Tiger Tyler, and I'm taking Batman Gabe. What? It's <laughs> multi. Why don't I just Why don't I just go and grab like Jesus Eduardo then? Like There's who no went Jesus up against Jesus Eduardo? Yes, it's there. Be There's no, no Jesus. He went. There's no Jesus yes, Eduardo. There is. Why don't you Why don't you just get Godzilla Eduardo? What exactly. <laughs> what is this? What is Jesus Eduardo? That's when he defeated Jesus. <laughs> You never did so that. So he became Jesus. There's yeah. no multiverse where you defeated Jesus. Yes, it is. Why are you defeating him? Because he's not a villain. Uh, good question. I don't know what goes on in that multiverse. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's going on in that verse. I don't control it. You grab Tony Stark, Eduardo, if you really want to grab another one of you. But you said you don't want to deal with a clone of Eduardo. No, I I would deal with a Tony Stark, Eduardo, because he's like charismatic and smart. But he's also egotistical. Okay. And he's you still. All right. You think you could deal with another you? I could. A he'd be, he'd be, smarter version of it, you who's egotistical and condescending? I'll be like, okay, cool. You'd be annoyed. To myself, yeah. You'd be very annoyed. You'd be like, Would shut up, stupid. It? What do you know about yeah. this? Maybe I grab Tony Stark Eduardo and Batman Gabe because I know Batman Gabe <laughs> keeps Tony Stark Eduardo in, in check. I could do that. Yeah. God damn. What about, what's it? Uh, Deathstroke Devin. Deathstroke Devin? Yeah, remember? It's the same timeline. Is it? Yeah. Oh. And then what? Jose, leeching Jose. Yeah. Leeching Jose. <laughs> grab leeching Jose. What is he going to do? I am ripped. No, Boy you meets world, Jose. Yeah. I am ripped. Is that ripped. the Jose you grab? If I had to grab a Jose, probably. You don't have to, but like, if you could. Yeah. I'll you grab, grab a... Boy meets world, Jose. Boy meets world. He is ripped. I'd grab a ghoul and Eduardo. he is he is a third degree. Ghoul Eduardo. Yeah, ghoul he is Eduardo. a third degree. Great. Back, back, back Are you just gonna belt. be the council of Eduardos then? Yeah. <laughs> I'm getting Tony, Tony Star Stark Eduardo. Tony Stark and Eduardo, Eduardo, Eduardo. Ghoul Eduardo. Fine. I'm getting Batman Gabe and what, what scientist Gabe from the that died in that verse. Time? Yeah. Yes, but it was died for plot. <laughs> it's the same reason Natachi died to Sasuke. It's like I had to. Okay. It's not because you were stronger then, than me. Then I. <laughs> I created you. I, it's not forget, I forget who created I forget. you. I always, I always oh, get yeah, reminded. You're like, Joe, your Joe X Jose is OP. <laughs> <laughs> forgot how OP you are, Jose? I did forget that. If you grab that, Jose. Not He's OP. a menace. Not OP <laughs> enough. Oh, know, yeah. Do you want him on your safe. team? <laughs> He's like, oh, is that a child? <laughs> He's like, I'm going to kill him. <laughs> no, he only saving. killed because of you. Well, he won't, he won't, no, nah. he, he, he got to the point where he killed regardless, remember? No, I did not remember that. <laughs> but I have Batman games, so he'll keep him in check. He'll be like, don't kill. <laughs> don't do it. <laughs> like, what do you know? <laughs> yeah, I'll get That's Battle Hard and Eduardo on my team. <laughs> Yeah, I like how you switched your... It started off like, okay, I'll take the... Like, game grounded? <laughs> like, oh, I could go multiverse. Yeah. Got ghoul Eduardo. I don't know when Ghoul Eduardo came into play, but it's from the time later he killed you. Oh. Yeah, when you were like, mm -hmm. you were a villain. <laughs> you were like, the nuke is real, and I stopped yeah, you because you got idiots. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you got all butthurt that you lost. <laughs> Which is yeah. what you do when you lose. <laughs> True, you do get salty. No, I don't. Yes, you do. Like earlier, we were talking about like the yeah, how bad of idea of a clone. You're like, okay, okay, okay. I pushed the button. 
There's no button. <laughs> <laughs> you don't why was that. the button just there? Like, why did no one see it? Because I no one ever, how does no one ever it's underneath on it? the carpet. How no one I know it's one? there. Well, how so does anyone walk into walk your room? room? How come we don't just accidentally step it on it? It needs a certain amount. It needs 60 pounds of force. <laughs> you told me we have never applied 60 pounds of force to it? That's right. <laughs> and how do you know this? Because <laughs> I'm the one who put it there. See what I mean? <laughs> Such a, a sore loser. loser. <laughs> <laughs> and then it pans out, and then I'm also in a tank. Like, no, Jose, you lost. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Then it pans out, and I'm chilling, watching from a TV. <laughs> Man, they don't even know about that timeline. We never, we never even talked about that one. We never did, no. but it's so funny. I think it's better left in mystery. <laughs> Uh, we could talk about it at some point. So, didn't you say it was going to be with Tyler? Yeah, but we never actually brought it up to him. <laughs> it's true. For the amount of times he's been here, we have not brought it up. <laughs> true. I think it'd be it'd be probably better if we all talked about it since we were actually there. Because mm -hmm. Tyler would just be listening, and Tyler mm -hmm. likes to talk when he's here. True. So he, we can get his input on it. Because if we just talk about it without him, he just he'd hear the episode regardless. So mm -hmm. he'd still hear the story. <laughs> true. <laughs> We could do it like tomorrow. We could. I'd have to like, I'd have to go back and refresh my memory of what happened in the story. Oh, line. I know what happened. <laughs> Cause I, I mean, I created it. Yeah, it was I like, remember it, it was like a, what would you do if kind of thing. Yeah, I know I, how it started. I remember the beginning. I just have to get all the details right. So I'm gonna like, it'd be like a podcast episode I actually plan out mm -hmm. and talk about. It's pretty funny. Mr. Was, Butt here. here. I had a good run, man. <laughs> you did, so why don't you just accept it? I wanted to win. <laughs> you were a villain. Why'd you want the villain to win? Cause it's me. <laughs> killed for fun. Yeah. I and I killed for revenge. It's kind of weird that you killed. I thought you were supposed to be a good guy. No, After we already established I why I killed. What? Because you didn't like Jose? That's kind no, of messed up, man. Was Wait, what did Jose reason. even do to you? Jose didn't do anything. I didn't do like, anything. He didn't, do, he didn't help me. That was the thing. He just <laughs> let me to die. And I was like, how could you do this to me? I thought we were homies. And you were like, I kill children. And I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and it was because you hunted me down, too. What? Gabe yeah. put you on me. He was like, hunt down Eduardo. And you are like, oh, okay, bet. Oh, after yeah, I, true. After uh, I'm done killing children, I'll hunt down Eduardo. Like, <laughs> Is that an elementary school? <laughs> is that a, is that a school? F I don't know if we can say that actually. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, "Is that Jose?" And you're like, "It's me, Jose." <laughs> it's me, Jose. <laughs> and then I'm like, I'm trying to run from you, and then you're like, not like giving up. So I had to like outmaneuver you. I remember that it was like the one thing I will lie that I was a little overboard was killing that one girl on your island. That was kind of messed up. That's she, the one. She was just chilling. <laughs> actually, I will agree with you. That was overboard that was for me, villainous. but I did it for a reason. That was he wasn't in his right mindset. <laughs> yeah, he I wanted you to know how it is to you, lose you're someone. You were bloodthirsty. Yeah. He didn't even kill anyone close to you. I did all the killing. To yeah, you. I wanted you to be like this is. He was my puppet. <laughs> I'll be like, this is your fault. <laughs> Jose was just like the definition of being used. And you took it out. You hurt the messenger. I'll be like, because I already killed Gabe. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. This is You were the you first person first. I went to. No, I'm were you last. Not? Were you last? last? I thought you were first and then Jose was last. No, I was last. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I was like, oh, Jose probably knows where Gabe's at. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I kill you. And then you're like, and then the, the nuke blows up. And and it's, and no, wait, what did you say? Up. It pans out to the another screen. <laughs> no, yeah, you, you said are, the first island, right? You were like, it was like then, a simulation. And then it pans <laughs> out. Yeah. It and pans you're like, watch it. Like, no, we're spoiling it. <laughs> <laughs> we're spoiling the, the ending. Uh, there's your little trailer. We'll get to it. <laughs> yeah. That was a good one. <laughs> and yo, uh, just I'm, go over I'm there. So, dude, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be honest. I'm actually excited to tell this like <laughs> hypothetical. Not even a story. It's a hypothetical. <laughs> It's a story. Is it a story? It's basically Honestly, a story. Honestly, we could, if we record that tomorrow, we could just make that episode come out first. Mm -hmm. And then that way it would make sense when you said you choose Ghoul Eduardo. They'd be like, oh, I know that Eduardo. No, it could I, we could use this to tease Ghoul to tease Eduardo. Him. And they'll be like, yeah. who's Ghoul Eduardo? Oh my God, and I can't wait to. <laughs> exactly. Joe X timeline. Who else was OP? I think it's just me. I think it was just us it's three. It's just us three, yeah. Because Devin dies. Artist dies, Tyler Eddie dies. dies. Yeah, they all die. I think everyone dies but me and Jose. 
Yeah. And then, well, me. But you were kept alive for a reason. <laughs> you had a purpose. Exactly. <laughs> Just you wait until to, until next week. You'll see the best antagonist in history, Gabe. Mm. Is it now? misunderstood <laughs> villain. Oh yeah, Jose tried to make himself misunderstood as well. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 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 that was funny you really tried it too yeah, i was grasping for straws <laughs> i was like just die and you're like no i don't want it i misunderstood, I misunderstood. <laughs> i'll take anything i can get man you still lost because of one thing that you forgot that was brought up earlier in the story there's been no what if situation where you've won jose you always die and then you get salty you're like man Okay, then there's a button. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I want to live. <laughs> and then I backflip right in there. <laughs> and I reach for the gun under my bed. Oh, actually, did y'all see the new Chainsaw movie? Chainsaw, Chainsaw Massacre? No, I didn't. Did you watch it with uh, artists? I watched it with artists. It sucks. That's what she told me. It was really bad. Why? Like, the characters were unlikable. The story was moving pretty fast. And that was basically it, really. Was there killing? Yes, there was killing. Was the killing cool? No, no. What do you mean? No, not really. Wouldn't he like, like the guy have a chainsaw? Oh, you're right. He throws his chainsaw, and I was like, that is like the coolest thing ever, because he'll be like, there's this car running, and he's like, he just throws his chainsaw at the car. That sounds like it's a good movie. It does sound like a good movie. <laughs> Why? <laughs> the way you're talking about it, I think you must like it more than you like JoJo. You've never talked about JoJo this hi happy. Yes, I have. No, no you haven't. Yes, I like have. Jojo. You actually don't talk about Jojo <laughs> like you're happy. What do you mean? Like, I like Jojo. You sound so monotone. Yeah, because I always speak monotonely. No, you don't. Not, not just then. You're talking about the Texas Chainsaw Yeah, because I was like, that's like the only good thing about yeah, Texas. Yeah, like, oh, that was the coolest thing I've yeah, ever seen. Cool. So dope. Yeah, oh, my God. He would... The only thing cool about TCM was the chainsaw. <laughs> Other than that, I didn't like the characters. You don't like the characters in Jojo either. Yes, I do. Name one character you like. Uh, Valentine. You do not like Valentine. Yes, I do. You're only saying that because it's the popular choice. No, it's not. <laughs> it's a Name safe one character trait of him. Valentine? Determined. No. What the hell? What is that basic old character <laughs> trait? It's what he That's is. That's every anime character. Something unique to him. He's, uh, He's white. <laughs> he went from fat to it's Chad. Not a character trait. That's just a... You can't read Do you know what a trait pictures? is? What? It's just that Wardo couldn't read pictures and thought he was fat. Dude, he, he is. He's illustrated as fat at the beginning no, and then he gets ripped. Yes, no, he does. He's not. You just can't read. What do you mean? It's the picture. He no, looks you fat. You can't read pictures, Eduardo. He's not fat. He never looked fat. Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. He's just wearing a puffy suit. That's what Americans wore back in and the day. And then it shows him at the end. He's wearing the same puffy shirt, suit, I guess. And he's like toned, ripped. No, he looks the same. Just like low key racist, you think racist. all white people are fat. That is not true. You're telling me you've never seen a toned white man? That's not that's not from a different country. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, and there was a couple of dumb scenes, but you know it's a horror movie, so that's what I was expecting. Yeah. Once once you get older, horror movies kind of like lose their horror pizzazz because you kind of just like think this is all unrealistic. And I, I don't know. I can't be scared when I think of something is so contrived. I'm like, no shot. I'm just like, some dude's just hiding under the car with a chainsaw. And he's gonna be like, whooching. Isn't that what he does in the old movie? No. In the old movie, not the one you no. watch. Oh, he doesn't? He doesn't. Oh, what movie is that? I don't know. I think it's. I thought that was just in a, Halloween. I, thought, I, thought I think in the Halloween, was... Jason does that. Does right? Not Jason, no. Uh, Michael. Michael? Does he? I'm pretty I sure he does. Car? And he like cuts it. Yeah, in the newest uh, movie, he like cuts her ankles. I haven't seen the newest movie. She can't run. I'm pretty sure that's what happens. I thought that was a ghost thing. They're either hiding under the car or in the back. A ghost thing? Yeah. Well, Michael Myers hi hang heads out in the back. That's where he killed someone in the first Halloween movie. I remember that. Yeah. Mm. Oh, but yeah, you know, there's your. They also had a plot point about a school shooting. It went nowhere. Do horror movies even scare you anymore? No. You ever like, after you watch a horror movie, you're like, let me turn on some comedy to like <laughs> switch my tone up. No. I feel like you do, Eduardo. I think the you go home and you turn off, turn on the lights. You watch Impractical Jokers. <laughs> Is that what you do, Eduardo? No. I think the last time I was scared of a movie, when I was like a kid, 
What was it? Candy Candy? No, Monsters Inc. Gregory Horror Show? Monsters Inc. Monsters Inc. Inc. Yep. Of anything you could have said. Monsters Inc. Cartoon Monsters Inc. Monsters Inc. scared me as a kid. I, and then um, I got back into horror movies when I was like yeah, older. And I was like, oh, this is dumb. Did you watch a real horror movie? Did I what? Like when you were young, did you watch any real horror movies? I watch Monsters Inc. Like Frankenstein. Uh, it's like the know. first like horror movie you've seen. Like when did you what see was Chucky? That, what was that movie called? It was a uh, Pam's Labyrinth. Pam's Labyrinth. I don't know what that yeah. is. I've never heard. It's, of a, it's that. a Spanish movie about this girl. No, it makes sense. Named Pam. I remember watching the Chucky movies when I was younger. Were you scared of them? Yeah. I saw the Chucky all trailers. Not all of them. But yeah, I was at my grandma's house and she'd throw them on. I'd be like, oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> the doll is getting loose. And she'd laugh at me like, ah, look at you getting scared, pussy bitch boy. True. And I'd be like, damn. <laughs> I saw what? the trailers for Chucky. So that's why I was scared of Chucky for so long. For me, I think Annabelle has always been scarier than Chucky. Yeah. Probably, actually, yeah. I haven't seen Annabelle, but... I saw it. From the, I wasn't, from the trailers of it, it does look like it's, it's more It's a lot creepier. more supernatural, isn't I was, it? Yeah. I think I was too old to be scared by Annabelle, but I definitely think if Annabelle came out, like, back in the day, I would have been scared of it. Mm -hmm. But, also, like, unfortunately, I only had Chucky, so I wasn't afraid of dolls. After a while, Chucky just kind of became a comedy. It's always been a comedy, I'm pretty sure. I think the beginning ones, they took themselves as horror movies. I don't think so. You They've think always so? been comedy movies. Mm. I mean, they're like, they're slashers. Like the first like, two, they like, they weren't as comedic. And then after that, once it was like Bride of Chucky, that's when they started being no, comedic. No, they've been comedic. Yeah. Mm, that's when I took it. Always. I think the first horror movie I've seen was Insidious. And I saw Paranormal Activity. And I was terrified of Paranormal Activity. But I didn't, I thought Insidious was so like, I thought Insidious was like based on a comic book. So it didn't scare me. <laughs> But in Paranormal Activity, I was like, this is real. It looked real to me. Because of the found footage way? Yeah. 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 I was like, it's real. I can't believe it. Ghosts are real. <laughs> I just like to not think about the practicalities of horror movies when I'm watching them. I, I kind of low-key turn my brain off, and I'm just focused on the movie and <laughs> nothing else. You do that with, like, every movie. I do. <laughs> so why do you, like, preface with, like, horror movie? It's just movie. Movie Any or show. movie, it you just, just turn off brain. It just makes it easier to enjoy. <laughs> then why don't you watch High School Musical? Huh? Why don't you watch High School Musical? I don't then? like musicals. Turn off your brain. You don't like no. musicals? No. Mm. He liked Hamilton. I never saw Hamilton. Oh, you like Hamilton? No, don't do that. <laughs> Now my dad's gonna hear the episode and be like, "Oh, let's go!" No, I know, you're always shot. like, you're always like waiting for that perfect moment to watch Hamilton. <laughs> oh, I'm not. It's never getting watched. <laughs> I hate music. I didn't realize how many people liked Hamilton until like the recent years. I know it's so bad. Like, why are we liking this? <laughs> In fact, they just pretend. You think they just pretend? Like they, yeah, they've got to be because it makes them seem. It's like pretentious. Like, oh my god, this guy's so deep. He likes Hamilton. He knows what Hamilton is. Oh my god. True. I think there's like a small group of people who actually do like it, and there's people who like pretend to seem cool. Or deep, mm. like you. Me? What do you like Hamilton for? I I never seen Hamilton. I don't even like Hamilton. Why are you always listening to the soundtrack then? Am I? Yeah. What song is on? Is in my playlist that's on the Hamilton soundtrack. I don't know. I just heard you listening to it. When? In Discord with artists, you were listening to the Hamilton soundtrack. What's, what song? I don't Hamilton? know the song. I don't know I don't either. Like the movie. I don't know either. It's a movie. I'm pretty sure. It's I thought a it was a play. I don't know what it is. It's both, but I'm pretty sure the musical is a movie. That's what the songs come from. I don't know. I haven't seen a, anything from Hamilton. I think the only musical I've seen is like Rent and High School Musical. And Rent, um, Rent's amazing, so I don't count it as a musical. It doesn't count, it's different. I've if seen, you watch Rent, you will never consider it a musical. It's, I've, it's I've only seen different. High School Musical and Heathers. What is Heathers? Is that like Lily Blonde? Isn't that the one where like everyone's named Heather? Where three girls, they're like the popular girls, are named Heather. Oh. Never seen it. I remember Eddie was talking about that for like a month yeah. when he first saw it. It has good music. Better than Legally Blonde? Never You've never seen, seen the musical, have you? Have you seen, seen Legally Blind? Blonde? What? Legally Blind? That's, I just said I haven't seen it. No, I said Blonde. I said Blonde. Just Blonde or Legally Blonde? Legally Blonde. And I, I said Legally, legally blonde. blind. You should watch a Legally Blonde musical. I like their music. Oh, okay. Better than Hamilton. Hamilton, I, I need musicals. Know. 
Yeah, you. Who, what are you? Why are you acting different? What's I the see point of acting listen? different? I could just be like, yeah, like Hamilton. But you that's don't. all I gotta say. I but don't. You don't. I've you never seen Hamilton. Time. I've never seen Hamilton. You listen to the soundtrack. Though. I don't. Yes, you do. I, I don't know any songs yes, from Hamilton. Yes, you do. You do. No, I don't. Yes, do. I don't know a single song. <laughs> Neither do I. You were listening to it. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't because, know a Hamilton no, song. No, you were listening because you were singing it, and then How does I it think go? artists said, "I don't know." Yeah, obviously, I, don't I was care. singing, wasn't I? And the artist was like, "What are you singing?" You're like, "It's a Hamilton." No. <laughs> yes. No, sir. That was not me. It was you. I gotta ask artists, bro. Ask you. Her. You lie. I'm not lying. And as soon as we turn off the podcast, you be like, "Yeah, I like Hamilton." No. <laughs> yeah, that's what you do. I haven't heard a, a I haven't seen anything from Hamilton. I haven't heard anything from Hamilton. You did that last time when we ended the episode, and you like kept denying it. And as soon as we turn off the episode, you're like, "Yeah, it's true." What are you talking about? From what? I don't even remember. It was yeah, like it was like weeks ago. <laughs> but it was. I was like, "Bro, go go back and record." You're like, "Nah." It was like the Jesus one. I was like, you don't actually <laughs> believe you beat Jesus. You're like, yeah, I don't. No, I do. <laughs> That's <laughs> the thing. I do. I, I, uh... different. Jesus Eduardo. <laughs> <laughs> that multiverse doesn't exist. There's no Why multiverse not? where you're beating <laughs> Jesus. Okay, how about multiverse where I defeat Godzilla? Nope. Why? You're never doing it's that. Multiversal. The only the best feat you ever had was stopping his foot. You didn't beat him. Yeah, I beat Godzilla no, you didn't. in that multiverse. I, I yes, was I did. There. I, what do you Cause mean? I said I stepped up and beat him. No, you did it. Yes, I did. Because I back and watch the said, episode. No, if you do go back, you'll say that I defeated Godzilla. And then no, like, and then I said I came back. To, no, and then I come back to you. Then you're like I'm stronger than you because I was scaled to Godzilla. And then you just so happen to be stronger than me. So I'm still stronger than you in that verse. Yeah, but you don't defeat Godzilla. You don't beat Godzilla, Wario. Like, I'm pretty sure you just like catch his foot. No, I don't. Godzilla in this Godzilla scale. Don't we just let Godzilla leave? We just let him chill? No. And we said we let the the world come back to deal with him. No. Or I kill him. No. You didn't it was beat me. him. I beat him. It was beat literally him. me. No, you're you're the hey, one. Jose, who... do you remember what happened to Godzilla in that episode? Uh he stepped somewhere. Yeah, I, I, I remember Eduardo caught the foot. Is what he says. Uh -huh. I, I was like, it's just, it's like, just it he claims to catch cow. the foot. Yeah, it, just okay. weighs, it weighs a little more than a cow. And then, but after that, I don't know what happens. I'm pretty sure I came. No. <laughs> and then no. I was like, no. hey, hey, what, what you doing over there? <laughs> and Godzilla was like, <laughs> rather than went back into the water. So he dipped. <laughs> yeah. No, that's not what happened. <laughs> oh, you weren't there. I'm, I'm pretty right. sure I like flared my traps at him or something, <laughs> and he he like got scared. I'm like, you're like, what you know about? <laughs> yeah. No, I I don't know what happened. <laughs> uh, I bet Tyler or Devin knows. I guess we'll find out yeah, when, Devin when this comes episode. out. They'll probably either comment it or text me. Dude, I guess I could always look at it. I don't want to go back and look though. That was so right. long. Dude, I love it. I was listening to it a while ago while I was at work and I was like, this is hilarious. I kept chuckling to myself. We need to do more. We need to do more episodes like that where we come up with what if scenarios. Hypotheticals. Yeah. yeah. We had one a while ago. Well, that's yeah, what we're going to do, I guess, next episode with Joe Pex, but mm -hmm. we've already done it. Maybe it's not we can add on to it. just retelling it. Yeah, it's a retelling of a hypothetical. Yeah. We could always add on to it though mm -hmm. while we're telling it though. Where I, I have I'm, where I have this machine. I think I'm definitely gonna change the beginning because it's very problematic. <laughs> oh <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna change the beginning. We, yeah, you to should make it fit yeah, and the end. This. I have this no, machine. No, no, no. Right? is not changing. You say it, it when we get to the end. It was, <laughs> if you want to add something to the ending, you say it when we get to it. Fine. I'm not gonna add Such anything. Such a sore loser, Jose. <laughs> I'm just gonna change the trajectory of how we got to where we got to. Okay. Why are you such a sore loser? He doesn't like losing. He queen. loses. All, it's because he always loses in real life. He doesn't want the hypothetical him to also lose. I want a queen. Why don't you just make it more believable? I do. No, you don't. He just, he just sucks at it. It's like, what are you doing? Oh, I'm saying, let's kick it, vampire. <laughs> <laughs> he kills you. Why he do that? <laughs> that was <a> big idea. <laughs> You say no. Nah, you some say dude no. knocks on your door. Asks you really saw Eduardo just tell you the, the right way. He said no, because if I invite him in, he kills me. And then he goes to you, Jose, after you heard him say yeah. that. And you said, yeah. I'm not going to say the same thing. That's that's boring. It's the right <laughs> answer. That's boring. I want something different. Maybe something else will happen. And then we'll get to another and then what happened? timeline. He died. I did die. <laughs> vampire. So like, because the vampire can't come in if you don't invite him in, right? Obviously. Yeah. But... He can still like throw stuff at you from the outside. Yeah. yeah. He opens the door and he's like, "Can I come oh, in?" Nerd. And you go, 
You go, no. He goes, okay. He flicks a needle at your neck. Yeah, just click. <laughs> He's like, ah. what is that? You just like, ah, take it no out. Diff? Yeah. Why are you like that guy? <laughs> I am the guy. What do you mean? Is that a vampire Eduardo? Yeah. Are you taking him as well? In the multiversal war? No. Because I don't know if this battle is going to take place at night or not. So there's, I'm not risking having <laughs> <laughs> dead weight. Vampiric Eduardo. Yeah. I mean, just give him the umbrella. You can't <laughs> fight with an umbrella. I'll take I'll take Professor X, Gabe. What? <laughs> From Professor Joe X, X? Gabe would be clutch. When, no. when is when is why? Okay, so remember. Okay, a little bit of a spoiler here, but kind of this was this was like Joe X point two. This is like when we were we this is when we told Eddie. Remember, and we, yeah. we threw on more. <laughs> so remember when after everything was done in the storyline, we went. There was a multiversal in that multiverse. There was a multiversal. Other Gabe's coming, and there was Professor X Gabe. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. So I'm grabbing Professor no, X Gabe. Professor X Gabe. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's because he's gonna this, lead my team. In this multiverse, okay. we got then, we brought up multiverse. And then I'm getting Doctor Manhattan. Jose. There's no Doctor Manhattan. There's Doctor Manhattan. Jose. Manhattan. 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 Jose. Did you there not was, see him? The <laughs> dead. Who's right there? There was no not Doctor in the Manhattan. Right there. How are you gonna bring? How is, <laughs> how, is, how is a multiverse of Jose gonna come over if there's no Jose? Do you know who Doctor Manhattan is? I'm getting Dark Side. Gabe. Okay. I'll get Thanos get and <laughs> and You're dead. No, I'm not. Okay, Dark side's I'll, omnipotent. I just go. <laughs> I'll get Dark Side Eduardo then. <laughs> <laughs> I can do what you're doing. It's a multiverse. Yeah, there's, there's no Doctor Man, not Jose. <laughs> the way the multiversal rules work in this, it's only hypothetical we've discussed before. There's never been a hypothetical <laughs> where there's Doctor Man, not Jose. Wait till the next time. <laughs> We're not bringing up this. <laughs> if you bring it up just so he exists, doesn't count. <laughs> Just so you okay. can drum. <laughs> what if I became Dr. Manhattan boys? Thoughts? <laughs> thoughts, thoughts, thoughts. <laughs> like, no, I brought him up before, so now I can bring up another discussion. <laughs> no, it's not how it works. The multiversal joke yeah, rules you, only work if it's been in the hypothetical. You can't plant a seed just for it to be used later on. <laughs> That's how that works. No, no it's not. Uh, how about? Doomsday, Jose? No, Jose. No. This is, you've never been brought up to me <laughs> for Doomsday. Just wait your turn. I'm sure I'll find more hypotheticals <laughs> and you can be strong. I don't know about Doomsday. Why do you want to be a villain? <laughs> Why do you pick a villain? It's more fun. Being a villain? Yeah. I don't know. I think Spider-Man's life's pretty fun. Yeah. Okay, no, it's, it's not. It's not. Yeah. But, but like when he is Spider-Man, it's fun. I mean, when, when he's, he's doing Peter, the, he's not. When he's doing the fighting, yeah, it's fun. And he swings around. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah. But like villains still have more freedom. Do they? I mean, they have to like, they have to hide their identities as well. They're whatever, criminals. Whatever. They have to deal with making enemies of other people too. Whatever. I don't know. Especially not Gotham villains. I definitely don't think their life is fun. They have to deal with like turf wars. I'm and talking about that. like a super villain. Like what? Thanos? Like Galactus Jose. Why are there Galactus oh Jose? God. There's no Galactus <laughs> Jose. Are you saying because you're fat, you eat just like a planet? Mm. There's no Galactus over there. <laughs> <laughs> Blob Jose. Oh, that reminds you know who Blob me. Is? There's no. this one funny part about Peacemaker where he just starts like making fun of Batman. I remember that part. I remember seeing that. I was like, that's funny. I've never really seen this been done. He called before. Batman a bitch. Well, yeah, it's like, true. Yeah. He's right. Batman just, just killed him. They wouldn't come yeah. back. He's like, do you have a, uh, what's a rose? I don't know. What Coterie. would it be? Coterie of villains. A Coterie of villains? Like, no, but Batman does. That's because Batman's a pussy and doesn't kill his villains. I was like, you're right. You're right. Uh, oh, my villains. We don't, down we don't want Batman to kill, though. Batman kills, it's over for us. True. Once he gets a taste of blood, it's over. Mm -hmm. So we're, we're glad he doesn't. <laughs> oh, damn. The world would be over if Batman kills. Crazy. I, I just realized I have a lot of good multiversal counterparts. I have Professor X Gabe. I have Batman <laughs> Gabe. Yeah, me too. No, no, you don't. You just have, like, Destro Jose. And then, like, Boy Meets World Jose. <laughs> you have what, you have, what a spectrum. <laughs> you, have, you have trained assassin Jose and bum Jose. Yeah. And bum Jose still ripped. I guess. I he's suppose. Weak. He's also a crybaby. True. He's also Can you lazy. build me this sofa in one of your please? Don't look at me like that. Like, you weren't a bum in that scenario. You're going to bring that Jose into the war, and he's going to be like, where's the couch? <laughs> he's not going to even fight. Did we say that hypothetical on podcast before? Uh, 
No. Uh, no. We did bring. Yeah, we did bring it up. We brought it up after a while because we were like, oh, there was a hypothetical from Razu when we were at Razu's. Was it with Tyler? Mm, I don't remember. I don't think so. Crazy. We could just bring it up tomorrow. That is crazy. I, I'm thinking. I I was thinking about it. I'm like, I don't know if they even know that hypothetical. Sometimes, because our conversations all blend together, mm -hmm. and I don't really know. I don't think they do. I don't think we've. Uh, maybe we might not have brought it up. We might not have. Yeah. Well, I guess. I guess. Yeah, we could bring it up tomorrow. I guess mm -hmm. that one's shorter and easy. Yeah. I'm mean, tomorrow can be just be like hypotheticals, you know, introducing these multiversal groups. No, I thought we did with Devin. Did we? Devin episodes. No, wait, because we said that at Roadhouse with Devin. Yes, yeah, so I guess we never did say that. And probably mm -hmm. not. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah, Tomorrow is just going to be though. us introducing the multiverse. <laughs> True. It's fitting because Multiverse of Madness trailer came out, I guess. Oh, did it? Did you put Multiverse in the trailer to get those views? <laughs> the job multiverse. The multiverse is real. <laughs> I got to think about all the multiversal things we've done. <laughs> like defeat Godzilla. No, Eduardo, you didn't do that. Yes, I did. Don't be upset because I didn't. You, did, you didn't beat Godzilla. You might have said you beat him in the episode, but we didn't. We no, didn't there were see facts. That there were facts on why I no, defeated Godzilla. No, there wasn't. You, you're like I hold him up. Yeah, we were. We did all the math and everything. The only thing we gave you is that you could possibly hold him up, and like that was a maybe. Yeah. He just I'm weighs, sure there is a multiverse like, where you hold him up. Like we no said, he weighs a little. <laughs> he weighs over a, like a cow, just a couple cows. A lot more than a couple cows. That's when we found out that cows can like weigh up to a thousand pounds. Man, that was crazy. Yeah. I told you that. Mm hmm. I told you that because that's uh, how much they weigh when I went cow tipping. Yeah, I told you I went cow tipping and you're like, no way. And I was like, yeah. You did say that. Yeah, I remember uh, cars? Yeah. Was that basically you? did that, but with real cows. Yeah. Isn't it crazy to think that the like giant like tractor thing in, in cars is supposed to be a bull? Yeah. It's supposed to have sex with those like small little cows? Yeah, I'm yeah. sure they grow up. They don't. Mm. They're fully grown. I see. Yeah, it's a tractor. Car's anatomy is weird. <laughs> yeah, I a guess lot you, about I, car anatomy is weird. I guess you really just cannot compare it to like a normal human body. You can't. <laughs> no, you can. No, you can't. Tires like fingernails. No. No? Tires? Yeah. Because what, what would the racing like be? They also move we have nails them. on our hands and nails on our feet, and they have four tires like hands and feet, so it'd be nails. Uh, I don't think so. Well, like, and when they change their tires, it's basically like them like shaping them up, shaping them up. Yeah, it's like a manicure. I think that fits. I don't know. I don't think because so. I wouldn't say toes. You don't just like pop off toes and put them back on. So I think nails makes the most sense. I guess, but what would you consider their race? And then also, when Lightning McQueen went, wanted to be fancy, he painted the side of his tires white. It's like painting your nails. <laughs> or, yeah. So. I, I mean, I guess nails. I can agree with you on for the tires, but other than that, it's kind of. And then hard. their teeth are teeth, mouth, mouth. Mouth, mouth. Eyes, mouth. eyes. Yeah. Like, did, were you there when I was telling you, like, you know how, like, the original. When he has to, clean, when he has to, like, fix the road? Yeah. Did I tell you, like, what the original thing was that they were going to plan to do with it? What? They were gonna uh, like switch out his conscience from his race car into that, into I don't even know what that's no, called. You lied. They didn't think that. No, that was you that was like that. that was the original plan. You didn't say no. that. No, he did say that. It was did in you? yeah, it was he in the, the artboard. It was when we were playing exploding kittens and oh. we were watching cars. Mm -hmm. Oh, that reminds me. We got a we got another one. Another got, exploding like, kittens. Yeah, it's yeah. like a, it has different it has different cards. Oh, cool. Yeah. Uh, that was the now won the Jenga tournament. True, oh, yeah, you did, did win the win, Jenga. That's because you're staying smooth criminals. Okay, yeah, you're cheating. Oh, you have smooth criminal Jose. Oh my. That's not <laughs> <laughs> there is a Jenga tower. <laughs> okay, it's not only for Jenga. You can make anything loose. Yeah, and then I have my like luck ability, Eduardo. Make his like knees loose or something. I don't know. <laughs> there go your kneecaps. <laughs> and then luck Eduardo would be like, oh, that didn't work. I don't think that's how that works. I don't know. You lost exploding kittens. I don't think you're luck Eduardo. I didn't. I didn't lose that much. You did. You didn't win a single game. Yeah, you... I actually did win a game. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. No. You, also... it was you and didn't win a single game. I it was won. Devin and I won Natalie a were the only one to one. No. I won a game. It was Devin and Natalie. They're the no, only one to one. Yep. You also lost like the second turn at Jenga. I did. Yeah. I don't know how That's you did that. Feat. That's not that a is a feat. feat. That's a negative feat. That's a nigga feat. <laughs> it's not a good one. I said nigga feat for the 
<laughs> for the you've used the word know. before. It doesn't matter. I just want them to know. I didn't say what? the other one. I said <laughs> neg uh, you know, like negachin. Yeah. From yeah. <laughs> from the fairy god. Like negative. Yeah. yeah. What'd you say, Jose? Negative. Nah, bro, you ain't say that, bro. You, ain't slick. you should see what Jose Neg- said at the store today. What did I say? I don't even know. What did you say? <laughs> it's, it's, I don't <laughs> it remember. It was something like the N word. I was, I was reading like some food products. <laughs> Wasn't it ice cream? Uh, was it? I don't. Ice know. cream was it? Uh, I don't know. It's, he definitely said like nigger. I didn't say. <laughs> 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 Whoa, Jose. I said something and you were like, what'd you call me? And I was like, what? Oh yeah, it was an ice cream section. I don't remember what though. You guys didn't well, even get ice cream. Ice cream. With an N. Yeah, we did. Did you? Well, yeah. Ice cream even starts with an N. There was no ice cream to start with an N. You said it though. Ah. There was. I guess he just said it for no like, <laughs> Alright, that's like, not what happened. <laughs> if you can't think of a reason, that's just what it had to have been. We were just walking, he was just like, nigger. And then it kept flowing. <laughs> He's like, what'd you call me? Nothing, 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 nothing. You know he is. He's racist against me. <laughs> Only Gabe. <laughs> Fair enough. I am his least favorite black person. Why well, you gotta think about it, Jose? Terry Crews exists. You don't like Terry Crews? I do like Terry Crews. Oh. That's the only one you like? You don't even like The Rock? The Rock? Is I thought he black? was Samoan. He's Samoan. Well, he's still black. If The Rock said the N-word, do you think we would question him? No, he's too much of a monster to be questioned. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be like, all right, you said it, The Rock. Uh, I'm not going to do That's all you, man. I'm that's not going to cancel you. you on Twitter. You're going to, like, cancel my knees or something. True. All right. You want to end it off? Yes, yeah, sir. And with We're that, done. this is the end of the JOWP podcast. You can find us on iTunes now, Anchor, oh my God. Spotify. Google Podcast, Google, Google, and Google Podcast, exactly. Back and YouTube, of course. Anchor. I already said Anchor, Jose. Spotify. What? Spotify. I already said Spotify. Okay. I can do that too. What? Yeah. And with that, we're out. I'm hungry.